There we go. All right. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Table Flipping Board Games. Today, we are going to be playing Mansions of Madness, which is a very highly requested game uh, that people have been wanting to see on this, uh, I guess, month of horror games leading up to the Halloween at the end of this month. Um, today, I am jo or we're joined by uh, De Febuar, of course, who's been, who's been on the show twice now, right? This is my third time. Yeah, so uh, good to have you back. And um, of course, we already have uh, Gillyweed and Game Face Killer as uh, the two co-hosts here. We are a little late getting set up, and uh, sorry about that. But this game does require a little bit of setup, and uh, we missed a page. But I think we're going to get there. And uh, in the meantime, Game Face, you want to tell us a little bit about this game? Yeah. Uh, there is a lot of setup with this game, so be ready. Um, <laughs> if you're planning on hosting a Mansions of Madness party, you might want to get there a couple hours early. <laughs> um, so this is Mansions of Madness. Uh, it's got an average rating of board game on Board Game Geek of 7.45, ranked 155. Um, Gilly was just just revealed. It's one of her favorite games. I think it is mine too. Although I think it's kind of divisive with a lot of gamers. Um, they either love it or hate it. Um, it was designed by Corey Kaniska, who is probably my favorite game designer of all time, and obviously he's my favorite game designer of Fantasy Flight. He designed the amazing Battlestar Galactica, um, Gears of War, uh, Space Hulk Death Angel, which I love that game too. He's he's basically the master of the cooperative game. Um, he, it was published by Fantasy Flight Games in 2011. It plays with two to five players, although I kind of agree with the Board Game Geek crews that say it plays best with all five players. Um, although we're going to be playing it with three, uh, and I think it's still fun. Four. Uh, four. Four. I'm sorry, four. <laughs> we're playing with just one less. Um, but if you have the chance to play it with a full group of players, it just makes it a lot more interesting. There's a lot more story and a lot more going on. Um, it does have an extensive use of text, so that's kind of a big warning. There's a lot of reading to do. Uh, so if you have someone who loves reading, that's awesome. If you're not a big fan of a lot of reading and a lot of atmosphere, then this game might not be quite your cup of tea. Um, it is a 1v4 game, which I'm not usually a huge fan of, but I think there is enough uh, to make the one person by themselves feel more like a dungeon master and less like an opponent that it keeps it interesting as opposed to adversarial and um, everybody's telling a good story so it really makes it really interesting and it's a mystery game it's scenario based so there's different scenarios which makes it last forever uh, and then also there's amazing puzzles which you'll see eventually um, the, the base only game, game <laughs> yeah exactly that has puzzles <laughs> yeah it's, that it's I've a ever played. yeah it's a it's mechanic really cool. that yeah is really cool really interesting um, that adds a lot of flavor and atmosphere. Uh, the base game comes with five scenarios. Each one is changeable so that you can actually replay it a little bit. Uh, basically, the map stays the same, but the cards all get switched around, so the rooms you go into will be will have different events. Um, there's also a couple of expansions that are out and lots of scenario mini scenario pack expansions, which is really cool. Um, so for a, like for ten dollars, you can buy a whole new set story um, that places different cards in the game. Uh, basically, this is just like all the other Arkham games. The player, the hero players are playing the role of a 1920s era investigator, and they're getting pulled into another Lovecraftian mythos story. In this one, though, it zooms in on the action at just one place. So we're just playing in one location instead of racing around the city or around the world. Uh, and the, the idea is that uh, we're trying to solve some sort of mystery, finding clues going throughout the mansion. The other player is playing the role of the keeper, um, it's kind of similar to Descent or Imperial Assault where that person kind of runs the bad guys and the mystery and lays traps in wait for the investigators and is trying to accomplish some fiendish master, master plan and beat the heroes. Um, basically, each of the investigators gets a turn in the round and then the keeper gets a turn and then the round starts over again. During our movement, we'll move throughout the house. Uh, we get two movement uh, phases and one action phase and we can take those in any order uh, we'll basically uh, the movement lets you move obviously through the mansion and the action can do things like run you can run an extra space you can use a card ability uh, every 
investigator has some kind of ability they can they can use on their cards. You can uh, explore, which lets you pick up items and also solve mysteries and puzzles. And then, of course, eventually there are going to be monsters somewhere about, and we have to try to fight those too. Basically, the investigator's goal is to find all of the clues in the mansion. Usually they start backwards. So the first clue we'll find will probably be clue four or clue three. And then we've got to try to find clue two and then the clue one. And when we find clue one, that tells us our final objective. And at that point, we know how we have to win. Although the keeper actually knows the objective from the very beginning of the game. Uh, if we can complete the objective for, for the investigators, then we win. If the keeper completes their objective first, then uh, he or she wins. And basically, that it, there's also a series of tests, mental, physical struggles, combat, and of course puzzles. So we'll kind of get into that and explain those as we go along. Uh, but that's basically a general overview of the game. Uh, is there anything else? Setup time is, is rough. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah it, it's definitely not an entry-level uh, Arkham game. Um, you probably want to introduce something else before you get into it, but if you can set it up correctly and test it out a little bit on your own first, um, mm -hmm. definitely it's Be it. the payoff is nice. Because mm -hmm. it's a story-driven game and there's lots of surprises, um, the setup is basically all on the keeper. And so, right. like, Game Face Killer did all that he could set up beforehand, but it comes down to, at the end, like, me putting the clues in the right places, and it's like you have four different decks of cards that you are pulling cards from in the right order and making sure that you're putting them in the right rooms. So that's why it took so long, and we're really sorry that we ran late, because I had it all done, and then I scrolled to the next page of the PDF, and it was like, hey, don't forget to put these cards, too, and I was like, crap! So that's why it took a bit longer. But I'm glad you're here, Deb, to witness this game. It's so glorious. It's going to be awesome. And this time, we're not going to die in the freezer. Yes. We open no freezers. <laughs> oh, God. No. I remember that story. <laughs> I was to your <laughs> games, Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So um, oh. we've all picked our characters ahead of time, which is kind of cool because you get to customize your characters a little bit. There's basically two choices for your physical attributes and two for your mental. And then everybody has a starting amount of sanity and health. Uh, then you usually have some kind of starting item that kind of uh, separates you from the others. Uh, our health and sanity is going to be tracked using these dice. So the red is for health and the blue is for san uh, sanity. And you can increase or decrease it by hitting the Q or E button. And then the green die is for keeping track of your skill points. If you want to keep track of them on there. Um, I'll get uh, yeah, let me just so, make sure there's nothing else oh, okay. ahead of time to tell these guys. Oh, their that countdown should be... be 20s. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, we always start with a nice little background story to set the stage. It's always cool. And you... Okay, you did get all the keeper action cards. Okay, so the prologue is, first of all, we are playing scenario number four, or story four, Classroom Curses. The last time we played this was story five. So here's the prologue. Professor Helena Detain leads you across the frost-covered campus toward the new science building. From within the new wooden construction, the old stone tower rises up and dominates the landscape. Detain says, you should have the building to yourself for the afternoon and into the evening. I'm not entirely sure what it is Dr. McBride thinks you can accomplish in there that our own maintenance staff cannot, but it is her decision. Entering into the building's gallery, Detain turns on the lights to the room. The lights flicker for a few seconds, but ultimately illuminate the room. A terrible smell permeates the building. Detain explains, the medical samples we keep in storage have been inexplicably thawing out. It creates this terrible rancid smell, and we have to throw out all these rotten specimens. Everything else the students seem to be able to live with, but this rotten smell is too much. Ew. So one other thing I forgot <laughs> is I was supposed to read the background information before you read that. Oh, okay. Well, that's the <laughs> okay. background information, too. That's okay. I'm sorry. Now. I forgot that there's something in the investigator book, too. Okay. Uh, you want me to go ahead and read it, or you guys just want to jump into it? No, yeah. go ahead and read it. Okay, so here's the story so far. The Hale Brighton University was founded in 1898, roughly a mile and a half to the southwest of Kingsport. 
Initially built within an abandoned army fort and its related structures, the school was established to provide young women with an educational experience that combined rigorous academic pursuit and an indisputable adherence to decency and morality. Most of the original wooden structures, already in disrepair when the university was established, have been torn down and replaced. Only a handful of stone structures remain today as they were. Recently, one of those surviving structures, a large stone tower, has been renovated and expanded to house a new science hall for the school. Dr. Patricia McBride, an alumna of the school, has donated a generous amount to ensure that Hale Brighton students will have access to the most up-to-date technology and research available. The Bride, McBride Science Building features a well-equipped laboratory and an extensive library of modern and classic texts that cover all branches of science, from biology to geology to astronomy. The old stone tower itself has been rebuilt to serve as an observatory for the night sky. With the exception of the tower's stonework, all aspects of the building are new, featuring the latest and most efficient systems for addressing the need for heat, water, and electricity. Given the expense and recent installation of these systems, it has been particularly vexing to the teachers and administration of the university that these basic utilities have consistently failed to work. Students regularly have to wear jackets in class during the autumn months, and lately frost has built up on the inside of the classroom's windows. Conversely, the freezer for the laboratory specimen sporadically stops working, leaving the freezer's contents a spoiled mess. Lights flicker and go dim with an alarming frequency. Sinks and other plumbing appliances often produce terrible noises and sputter mud rather than water. Every attempt at repair has met with failure. Although the director of the science department, Helena Detain, believes classes can continue despite these challenges, Dr. Patricia McBride feels differently. Students have begun to miss classes with more frequency. While your group of investigators are not necessarily specialists in plumbing and electricity, Dr. McBride feels your unique skills may be necessary to uncover the root of the problem. Now that's some reading. Let's go find yeah, the smell. Gonna... Find the smell. All right. So the clue in the story, they usually give you some kind of clue as to where to go first for the first clue. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to read the, la the last part or do you guys remember it, the prologue? Would you mind reading that last paragraph? Yeah. Uh, entering the building's gallery, Detain turns on the lights to the room. The lights flicker for a few seconds but ultimately illuminate the room. A terrible smell permeates the building. Detain explains, the medical samples we keep in storage have been inexplicably thawing out. It creates this terrible rancid smell and we have to throw out all these rotten specimens. Everything else the students seem to be able to live with, but this rotten smell is too much. Mm. Okay. So I have a feeling the first clue is somewhere around this freezer over here. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Which <Yeah. laughs> <Okay. laughs> I'm not liking the idea of going into another <laughs> freezer. Me All right. All right. Okay. Can we go somewhere else? <laughs> So we start with our investigator's turn, and basically each of us gets to decide who wants to go first, second, and third. Each and round, kind of, right? Yes, each round we get to Sweet. choose again. So and I'm kind of tint my guy. So this room has three spaces that you can stand in it, right? That's what these white lines Right, these denote. white lines separate the spaces oh. for movement. So every time you, you move one space, you move here, and if you move a second space, you move here, and then a third here, right? Yeah. So you'll move throughout the house. Um, and you have to open doors, right? Uh, nope. It just costs a movement to move through a oh, door. Okay. There are some doors that have a card on them that looks like a lock and mm -hmm. that is locked. So you have to usually figure out what the lock is and I figure see. out how to open it. And these, point. these cards that are hanging out everywhere, uh, if you they move are, to that space, you pick it up. Actually, if you're, as long as you're in the room within these brown walls here, you mm -hmm. can search anywhere in that room and it will reveal whatever is, whatever that card has to say. I see. So how about how about I go first and just find that out? Yeah, that'd be cool. All right. So uh, let's see. So I can, that's an action, right? Right. And I, have, and I have two movements. So two movements and an action. Right. And you can distribute those however okay. you want. Right. So I'm going to move. I'm going to look at this card. Okay. So Gilly uh, actually oh. reveals that card. Okay. Oh, sorry. She Just in case there's something. I see. You find nothing of interest. Oh, mm -hmm. hooray. All right. Okay. So then with my second movement, I'm going to move into here. Okay. All right. All right. So, Deb, would you like to go or would you like me to go? Uh, <laughs> this coat room thing, there's a thing in there. Yeah, there's something to investigate. Oh, I didn't even see that. 
Yeah, um, go get the coat room. I don't know what the squid means so, in the bomb there. <laughs> what that means is it's going to be some kind of obstacle. It's not necessarily a monster. It's It might just be some kind of uh, A baby puzzle. monster? Yeah, it might be some kind of puzzle or uh, some some something we have to do. But would it be to... something that we need to do? Are those ever so, things that we'll have to do before we can complete the game? See, that's the trick is that usually... That's why I'm at a disadvantage. Yeah, usually locked rooms like these or rooms with obstacles tend to have more important stuff than just these regular cards like this. Okay. But the reason they were, like, talking about Freezer is because the last time we played this, we that had one of those on a Freezer. Yeah, they, yeah. It, they just, like, walked in to the Freezer because there was one on there. Right. Do it. Do it. <laughs> yeah. What if I, okay, if I throw the game immediately, I'm going to be so upset. Okay, so <laughs> I'm going to go in here and so flip this thing movement. over, I guess. It's and a then, movement and then action to flip the, it. I love the ting sound when you pick that up. <laughs> oh, I wish I had some. I was just moving off the cards. Okay. So, and then for your action, you, you just say, I'm going to explore, and then she'll yeah, reveal that card. Yeah, explore that. Okay, so. Oh, God. This oh, there's is more than one thing. A locked yeah. cabinet. A large cabinet sits against the wall. Its steel door is tightly locked and requires a brass key. You may not explore past this card. Okay, so we found, yeah, so basically what we have to do is we have to find a brass key somewhere oh. else and come back and open that. Oh, so okay. You could, so you could use your second move to move back just, into the room. Just get out of here, yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay. All right. Throw so... pit. <laughs> I know. <right>? Yeah. <laughs> One shot, GG. <laughs> so I'm going to move here and then here for my second movement. And then I will go ahead and explore. You so find a sledgehammer. Sledgehammer. That is pretty good. All right. So I can attack a monster with this in my space. X equals my strength minus two. That's, that's good for him. He's kind of the heavy... So I'll collect that, and then I believe I I believe we're all finished. So now it's the keeper's turn. The keeper has kind of a strange set of uh, steps. Basically, the first step of the keeper's turn is investigators that are in the same space can trade an item if they have any items to trade. Um, I don't I want have your sledgehammer. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll keep it. Uh, and then the second step is Gilly gains threat equal to the number of players. Including me? Uh, yeah. It says per investigators. Oh, in investigators. Yeah, sorry. Hey, who made this one bag giant? Nobody. Why are you the worst? Oh, threat. Okay. There's your threat right there. So she has a starting threat of three, and then what she will do during her turn, or I'm sorry, four. You're right. Yeah. I during get her turn, oh, right. there are these various actions here that she has to choose from that cost different amounts of threat. So those kind of lay traps for us or spawn mm -hmm. monsters. Where are the trauma cards? They are... are the... Oh, wait. That sounds wait. great. Right here. I know, right? They're not fun. Where are the trauma cards? I want to kill you all. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's my objective, but I won't be sad if you win it because I like, I like seeing the whole story. Um, okay. These are so zoomed in now. Um, I am going to I'm going to plunge a room into darkness. Uh oh. Oh, that was supposed to go back in the bag. <laughs> so it'll be the room, room that's the two of you are in. Oh, okay. Yay. Lights are turning off. So yeah. each investigator currently affected by darkness must test willpower. Willpower. Okay. So to do, so to do a test, basically what you do is you take one of these d10s over here, and you want to roll equal to or less than your willpower, which is on your mental card. So for All example, right. mine is a seven. You also have the choice at any time to spend one of your skill points to ink to add your luck to your willpower. So or your luck to a skill. So I think I'm just going to roll since I have a 7. That's a pretty good chance of succeeding. So I have to get a 7 or lower to succeed. And I, and I did it. Nice. All right, I have to get 6 or lower. Yeah. I did not. <gasps> oh. Ripped. <laughs> Ripped. <laughs> All right, so what happens? 
You take one horror. Which is a sanity? Yeah, you lose a sanity. All right. I'm still seeing guys. Right. Don't worry. And the room is dark, which means that there's a additional detriment to us. I'll look that up here in just a second. Can we make it light? <laughs> uh, yeah, we'd have to have a lantern or something. Oh, I see. Um, otherwise, yeah, some kind of item. Otherwise, it stays dark. If you want to explore this room, it costs you an action plus a movement to do so. Hmm. And then all attribute tests are minus two while it's dark in this room. Good thing we don't have to explore in here, though. Yeah. There is a barrier yeah. ahead of us, though. Do we have to do anything with that? So the barrier can be used if we want to block a doorway for from a monster. I see. Okay, so that's oh, like a, an aid for us. Right. Okay. okay. Interesting. Okay, um, I'm also going to spend a threat. No, you're not. <laughs> to draw one Mythos card and one Trauma card. Okay. And then that is all I want to do this round. So Mythos cards are cards that are possible traps that she can play on us. She can only play one on each of us during our turns. But she does have them in her hand. Huh. Okay, so it's back to us. Anybody want to go first? Uh, once I get in that room with you guys, do I have to do that darkness bullshit? Uh, I think I mean, that stuff. Was... No, that was, just, that was just because we were in there. We were, like, freaked out by it darkening. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can oh, go into a dark, dark room. It's just, like, when it plunges you oh, into okay. it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, hey, Ogre. Yeah, what's up? What's your sanity currently at? Ten. Oh, wait. Ten? Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm. Uh-oh. Yeah. I'm quite me. sane, thank you. <laughs> yeah, no problem. You seem very, I mean. very level-headed. Uh, I think that's the end of my turn. All right. Okay. So, want to go oh, to the bathroom? at the end of your turn, uh, Gilly puts an event token on top of the event deck. What? Oh, okay. Where are those at? Um, the event tokens are all right. Are they in here? How can you tell which one is which? They are. You all can hover same. over. They're right here. Oh. No. Oh. Okay. We're all looking oh. around the different bags. <laughs> Okay. So what do those do? What's that? When you get to uh, tokens equal to the number on the card, then we reveal the card, and it's they're like they're kind of like additional clues to help you guys along. Yeah. They I advance see. the story. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's cool. And what's cool with those is I haven't read those, so it's like really it's really one of the only surprises I get mm -hmm. to huh. in the story. Yeah, it's it's pretty fun how that's set up. Okay. So what? I Deb, do you want to just go ahead and do your turn? Um. Okay. I mean, I guess I'm just gonna like I get to move twice, right? So I guess mm. I'm just gonna come in yeah. there with you guys. You and can then move a third your, time. Yeah. So if you look over here, your actions right here that you can do, you um, are always listed there for your reference. You can actually move a third space by using your action to run. Oh. So if you wanted to, you can move up here, or if you want to move into the bathroom, somebody's probably mm -hmm. gonna go into the bathroom. <laughs> to investigate, I'm assuming. Well, if someone's if someone's going to go in there, do I need to be in there with them? That's true. You probably don't. You could just keep advancing forward if you want. All right, I'm just going to go up here in case we need to move this barrier in front of this door. Right. <laughs> For <Okay>. whatever reason. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Joe, you want to go uh, investi or investigate the bathroom? I know. Joe, 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 yeah. Diamond. Joe Diamond. Oh, Diamond. okay. I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> I got this. Joe Diamond likes to go investigate bathrooms. <laughs> I'll go. All He's right. going to sledgehammer the crap out of whatever this thing is. Yeah, and I'll explore. <clears throat> what did you find? That's a good question. Oh, Gilly oh, has I, to reveal thought... it. Right? Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. I thought you were checking cards, so I was just waiting. I was. Suitcase. You find a sturdy suitcase sealed by a simple combination ah. lock. You must solve lock puzzle number 6A to discard this card and continue exploring the room. Are you going to do that? Yeah, I'm going to try. It's time. Lock puzzle number 6A. Do you know where you get that? Yep, okay. I'm pulling out the locks. Guys, you're going to see the best part of this game. What is this? There are it's actual crazy. puzzles in this game. Oh. It's so cool. Okay, so I'm going to set them up here so Ogre can see them on his handy-dandy vision, yeah. visionometer. Vision do we get to help you, or do you have to do it by yourself? I actually have to do it by myself. Mm -hmm. um, oh, okay. 
So, oh, and I think the way you have to put them is, uh, so I'll, I'll lock this one, and then they have to start at the top left and go to the right, and then second row, and then so on. And you put the arrow pointing up. Arrow There's an up. arrow in the center, yeah. Right. So that one's got its arrow. Okay, so the trick to this is I have to make the 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 little tumbler locks, the circles, match the color and symbol of the middle plus part, the cross part. So, for example, if you look at this bottom right puzzle, there's absolutely no way I can make both of those blue. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to have to rotate out with this one up top. So basically I get a number of moves equal to my intelligence and I have a feeling Joe Diamond's not too smart. <laughs> <laughs> Dang he it. is. I don't even see any red ones. Doesn't that make this impossible? No. Yeah, uh, uh, yes. yes, this with with this here, yeah. With this yeah, with this setup, but there's a way to change out some. Oh. You use basically you use one of your moves. Like the number of moves you get is equal to your your character's intelligence. Uh -huh. And the moves include rotating a piece one quarter, um, swapping pieces with adjacent or, ones. Yeah, with adjacent ones, or trading out a piece for another piece. So you okay. could trade out another piece to try to get a red. Oh, and that's, I see. It actually costs two to trade out. So you've got to try to work with what you have if you can. Uh, Girl, is this correct or is that yellow? Oh um, no, it's yellow. Never yeah, mind. Yeah. I was like, you got really lucky with that one, but. So unfortunately, I only have a five intelligence, which isn't that great, but I can try to do something. Mm. So, so I am maybe going to. I should to... have gone in there with you. Am I yeah, smart? well, that's okay. You can always come in here oh. later. Am I smart? We oh, can kind I'm only of... six smart. What the I'm hell? I'm only six smart as well. Oh, we're all dumb. Yeah, Who's we the smart get one? The smart group. <laughs> it's okay, the, guys. We'll get nerd? it. <laughs> All right. So uh, let's see. I have four moves left because I just swapped the top and bottom right pieces. Uh, let's see what else. So now I now it looks like if I rotate the bottom right one just a little bit. So there's one of my moves. Now I've got the lock in the bottom right correct. Sweet. So that's mm. how many moves. So when you guys are doing puzzles, if you could not look at chat, they really want to be able to try to strategize oh, in yeah, how many moves they could do it. Mm -hmm. Okay, no problem. So I've got so I had five moves, I switched two and then I rotated one, so now I'm down to three moves. Okay. So ah, I can't do yellow and blue. You you gotta get lucky. Right? Oh, I mean, because you need you need two reds, so you have to use at least four to swap out. Yeah. Yeah, I don't but, think you'll get it this turn. But this one up here, I can rotate down Wait. here and use that. Isn't hold on? Isn't this six B? Didn't we want six A? Oh, Crap, that right. is six B. That is six B. That's why Dragoon Phoenix was asking. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Bye, puzzle. You guys got to see a later puzzle. <laughs> well, that's good though. Yeah, Do you want to reset maybe the we'll have... the way they were before. Reset the the tokens. The two, yeah, the the top and bottom. Just flip. Yeah, should be switched. Yeah. Okay, sorry everyone. Whoops, there, there we go. All right, okay. back up to well, this five. This looks much right? better for or you. Six? Five. Yeah, hopefully, yeah, back up to five. Okay. Okay. Now I can at any time spend a skill point to add luck to my intelligence, which gives me an extra two. But I'll see where I don't have to spend it just yet, so I'll wait and see if I can do Are, something. And we're not allowed to help you, right? Right. I have right. to solve it on my okay. own. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to mm -hmm. rotate this one one. So that matches that one. I'm going to rotate. Oh, wait, I can't do that. This is unsolvable here. But. Oh, it's so hard to not help you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me mute oh. your mics, fools. <laughs> Oh, I'm dumb. Can you, um, can you swap diagonally or only no. adjacently? No. Only horizontal and vertical. 
Okay. Well, poop. I wish that I had not. Okay, so I'm going to trade these out. Um, and that's another move. And I'll rotate this twice. So that one's... Do you so always have to rotate it the same way, or can you go counterclockwise? You can go counterclockwise. Is it any number of steps, or just one? For rotate, or uh, for... For every 90 degrees, it costs one action. Ah, oh, this is going to take forever. I know. Okay, so I've, I've got one move left. I'm going to go ahead and use one of my skill points. Hey, Ogre. Yeah? Could you super zoom in on the puzzle while he's doing it? Oh, yeah. Thank you. I thought I, I, thought I was pretty zoomed in. I can no, be I, I want you to be like all the ways. I can be zoomier. Okay. Thank you. So I just spent a skill point, and that adds two to my intelligence, so I'm back up to three moves. Okay. Um, so I'll rotate this one once, twice, and that one is set to, and then I'll rotate this one once this way. And that's all my moves, but I've got three of them done. That's good. Sweet. So we should be able to get somebody in there to finish that off, yeah? Yeah. I can go in there next. Okay. Cool. All right. Okay. So that was your turn. I still, yep. I can still pop in there. Now I can help you with this puzzle, right? Wait, are you going through a door? Yes. Yes. Um, I need you to test your strength, please. No, you don't. I do. <laughs> He just went through this door. I know. But it's slamming. <laughs> you jump as every door in the room slams shut. You frantically try to open one, but it is jammed. Oh, yeah. That flavor text is important. In them. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I failed it. You oh. may not move through any doors this turn. Oh, that's the worst. <laughs> he literally just went through that door. I know, but you can't. He, he, he <laughs> can, you can't. Fine. So you've got one more move and you one are more so action scared. Left, I know. But you can't move through anything. Can't move through I can't any move through doors. anything. And I don't think I can even use my action for anything. This is my discard pile. Kate Winthrop, oh. scaredy cat. Yeah, also, scaredy. The skill check was minus two, but monsters can't. Oh right, and the skill check was minus two. I really didn't make it. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, that's funny. Well, the good yeah, news is I can, I can always solve it next. I can try to solve it next turn because I've got to switch out pieces anyway. Yeah, actually, it was just game face killer doesn't want to share the bathroom with you, and you're really <laughs> hurt, so you can't. Well, he's done trying to solve it, so now he's actually going to use the facilities. So. <laughs> I'm going to take a minute to think about this one while I sit down. <laughs> <laughs> I love that it's in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> bathroom puzzles. Let me ponder this. It's like All Sudoku right. in the 30s. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just solving briefcase puzzles. Just check out no this big. little suitcase while I sit here. <laughs> oh. Okay, are we done? Are you guys yeah, yeah, we're done. Are we trading any items? I don't nah. think so. Or uh, you, nobody's in the same space. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. So I get three threats. Can you bank your threat? Huh? Yeah, she can actually. What happens? And these, but these cards only get replaced on the next turn, right? Wait, what? No, these what cards card? always stay. These, these ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're all. These, always, these are my. Actions. Oh, they're oh, they're and permanent they're actions. Completely okay. dependent on scenario. This darkest I one see. is not for everything, but obviously with the lights flickering, mm -hmm. it's cool oh, yeah, that, that that's in sense. there. Oh, that's yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, so you get to reuse them as many times throughout the game as you want? Every, yeah, every turn. Yeah, as long as she has the threat. Uh, so, can I use evil presence more than once? Uh, yeah. And the hand limit is five of each, correct? Four of each. Four of each, okay. So I'm going to do that. 
And did you see how if it's your first action, you can end your action step and to gain one threat? Yeah, yeah but I get quite a bit every turn. Yeah, that's so. true. Okay, I'm done. Okay. So we have another event token. I'll go ahead and place it. Thank you. So next time it's her turn, there's going to be an event. Okay. Okay. And we're going to have right. the damn briefcase open. Yeah, better. So do <laughs> you, Maybe it has that key in it. That's true. Yeah. Would you guys like me to go first? And that way, if I yeah. can't solve it, then we'll know who has to come in. Totally. That sounds like a good okay. idea. So I'm going to discard this one and draw a new one, which costs me... Oh, I forgot to put my points back. So I've got five more points to spend for moves. And I just placed this new one. So that takes two moves. Oh, man, we totally lucked out. Nice. That... That is awesome. Wait, but that's not in the exact place it needs to be, though, right? No. Uh, no, I mean, you I just need to it rotate once. it once, yeah. 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 Okay. So, boom. Uh, Use my last move, and then it should be unlocked. All right. What do we win? Okay. Another Good lock. job, team. <laughs> you get nothing of interest. Ah, also, good. a ceremonial school. <laughs> mm. We can get skill points with it. I would Why have led with the skull. Why was there a skull in a suitcase? And this is, uh, this is the one thing that I'm always very confused about, is when there is a nothing of interest as well as <laughs> So I think, what, I think the purpose of it is to make the investigators think there might be a huge cache of cards in there. I see. That makes sense. Like it could be a clue or whatever. Yeah, a bunch of cool okay. stuff. I see. So wait, where'd that ceremonial skull go? I want to look oh, at it. Oh, I put it in my equipment over here. It's ceremonial, and it was in a suitcase in a bathroom. So that says a lot. Well, maybe maybe somebody was doing the thanker and then was like, this is too good. <laughs> I need to hide this skull. And so he put it in his suitcase and locked it. That's true. Whoa. Someone with good luck has to try this. Yeah, I can always trade it with someone because I still got two moves left. What Does is anyone it? have a good luck? I do not. Yeah, I have you test three. luck and you get your skill points out of it. Who's lucky? Or no, it's Deb lore. Wait. Oh no, it is it's luck. luck. I'm sorry. Deb, you I lucky? Have... Um, I have three luck. Oh, none so of I us can... are lucky. <laughs> but she's the luckiest. So I'm gonna use my two movements to move here, and then I'll trade that to you on your turn or on the keeper's turn. Wait, you're moving oh. into a hallway? Yes. <laughs> you see a poltergeist. No. What? On the first space or the second one? Uh, I, you I just would throw down the card as soon as you move in there. Okay. You'll still be able to move anyway. So, a painting flies off the wall towards your head. Test willpower plus one, and then test dexterity plus one. Okay, so this isn't too bad. My willpower is a seven, so I got to get an eight or lower. Nice. Okay. And then dexterity plus one? Yep. My dexterity is six with the plus one. All right. Sweet. You make it? Yeah. Nice. You He's not scared of no flying painting. <laughs> I'm not afraid of no ghosts. So now you can come to my, come yeah. to my corner. So come I bet you're going to try to shrink me, ain't you, Doc? Give <laughs> me your ancient skull. Or whatever the heck it is. <laughs> this is a ceremonial skull. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna walk into the next room. All right. Can I <laughs> play something just on him I if he starts something? Mm -hmm. um, if he started in the room with darkness, or I, does yeah, it... you can actually play it before any okay. actions or movement are taken. So I'm gonna play this on you, Carl. Okay. What are you playing on me? Through the dark, you see a pair of red eyes slowly moving towards you. Oh, good. Take one horror. And I'm giving you kleptomania with that. Uh-oh. What's that mean? I may not give items to other players. I must also take one tradable card of your choice from an investigator in your space, if able. So we got to keep him out of our space. Although you could take all your it from stuff. me if you want. My lights are turning on. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> and then I could move you to up to two spaces, but I think I'll let you live after all, after giving you kleptomania. Okay. 
So every hero can have one mental trauma and one physical trauma. So Carl just got his first mental trauma. He steals stuff from people if he's in their space. <laughs> so is he aware of this, though? Uh, it's uncontrollable. So I think she knows she's doing it, but much like... Yeah, so I don't have to, like, so role play. So would it be something where not... she would know not to go near somebody, or is it right, something yeah, like... Right. Okay, it, all right. Yeah, she would have to... We have to avoid her, and she tries to avoid us. She she right. warns us. Okay. I steal stuff. She's like, oh my gosh, guys. I saw these red eyes, and now all I want to do is steal your stuff, so stay away from <laughs> me, please. Okay. Um, she says, if you would but lend me the skull. But it doesn't cost <laughs> anything. So what we could mean? strategically go in there if we wanted to give her things, right? Right. right. Okay. Yes, yeah. exactly. It's just that yeah. I have to. Okay, right. so it's a compulsion. Yeah. And you can also move into this space over here, and you won't have to worry about her stealing anything. Not mm -hmm. that you have anything to steal. But if you move through that space. No, the, no. It's only when you end in the space, same space. Oh, so. okay. All right. So my action, so I move to my action. I'm going to search this room. I'm sorry. That's me. Yep. It is. You find a shotgun. Nice. What? Nice. Oh yeah. Pew pew. Can you only carry so many items? Uh, nope. There's no limit. There's okay. usually not a lot of items, but. All right. I just don't want Klepto over here to get <laughs> weighted down. <laughs> <laughs> I'm overburdened. Hey, that's Klepto shaming. <laughs> <laughs> Triggered. <laughs> hey, I can attack through a door. Nice. All right. So I think, uh, Deb, you're the last player. Okay. All right. So, oh, I haven't gone yet. Don't yeah. I need to stay in this block to uh, get you? Your... Can actually you actually wanna... keep moving forward here if you wanted to. Okay. I thought I What's... needed to go get your thing or whatever. What's this vent over here? Yeah. What does so, it do? So vents aren't really anything for us. The the uh, the the keeper monsters can come through that. Yeah, they can move <laughs> from one vent to another. So here's the other vent over here. They can. Can move we from barricade the vent? Not that I know of. Ah, oh, dang. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But the only type of monster that can move through that is a beast, which are the brown ones. Mm -hmm. There's basically three monster types. <clears throat> can I stuff a coat in the vent? <laughs> it would be <laughs> it nice. Kind of small. Good. <laughs> Why don't you just steal the vent? Can you do that? <laughs> true. Can, I steal vents too. This is mine now. <laughs> Monsters will just appear in your pocket and be like, wow, what is this? <laughs> You're mine. And you will be my squishy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, but okay, so since I'm not in Tommy Gun's corner. Yeah, you can't get the friends. item from him. Um, um that means I can't take your skull. Right. What the, is your dex? Right. Wait, what does stun mean? So stun S is... Stun means I'm full of rainbows and happiness, obviously. <laughs> stun means uh, you may not take a, a second movement step. So you get one movement oh, step okay. and then a minus two to every attribute test. Okay, never mind. I'm happy with the way things are. Thank you. Mm -hmm. That's okay about giving you the skull. I'll get it to you sometime soon. Okay. Are you trying to move through the vent? Because you can't. I'm trying. You're not <laughs> I don't a beast. Fit. Okay, are you guys done? Yes. Does anybody so. want or have to trade at this point? No. I don't no. think uh -uh. you can, Merle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And... I'm going to plunge that room into darkness. Of course you are. No. Wait, the room is already dark? Nope. The it's room that you two have moved into. So what do we test again? Uh, willpower. OK. So Deb, your willpower is six. So you, if you take one of these D10s, you got to roll a six or less. OK. Wait, where are you rolling? There you are. I'll take this one. Nailed it. <laughs> Calculated. That's the weakest roll. 
Look at how yes, big your guy is. I what is this? Because bigger die means better rolls. Oh, okay. <laughs> so did you guys both Yeah, succeed? we both succeeded. Excellent. We're not scared of your lights. And then I'm them. going to draw one of each card. Okay. So is this other room is dark too, still? Yeah, it stays dark for the foreseeable future. Mm -hmm. Wait, how did this barrier get moved? Oh, uh, accidentally, I think. Oh, okay. I was like, um, poltergeist, hello? More spooky things are happening. Please stop, spooky. <laughs> so spooky. Man, we're a long way from the first clue. That's crazy. Usually it's a little bit closer. That's all How right. do you know where the clue is? It's well, right here. from the freezer. We're thinking it's in the freezer. If that's where we're going, then it seems like a, a ways away. You are a long way from the freezer. And we don't even want to open Actually, it. Actually, we know what's going to happen now, right? Because we put a thing on here. Oh, right. Oh, yeah. Or, well, you probably will get a hint as to where to go from it. The lights begin to flicker and dim. From the switches and fixtures throughout the building, sparks fly out, loud popping noise, fly and loud popping noises are heard. <laughs> a distinct odor of ozone and burnt wiring fills the air as some of the rooms are plunged into darkness. You don't say. Keep the keeper chooses two rooms and places a darkness token in each of them. Each investigator in either of those rooms must te test dexterity. You guys lucked out. Yeah, because oh, we've yeah. already got darkness everywhere. Can't but she could put them in upcoming rooms. And that makes us klutzier. Well, yeah, our skill checks are Sounds harder, and yeah. it costs us an extra Wait, movement. have you guys been doing... Did you guys have to do any skill checks in the dark rooms? Mm -mm. Okay. No, because oh, we didn't have did. anything to search, you, right? Well, when you plunge this one into darkness, they did. But didn't you guys have to do skill checks when paintings flew at your head and stuff? Oh, I did. Yeah, but it's you It's all right. Just you try wrecked to remember that. from now on. Yeah. yeah. I, are, did I roll low enough? To, oh, to pass? Yeah, you rolled like a two. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah I'll make sure. really low up. stuff. Okay. So right. I will plunge this hallway and the laboratory into darkness. Hey, guess which way we're going, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wait, this thing's locked too. Doesn't mean that there's something here. Yeah, but we can't. We have to go up this way to get to it. There's no doorway up here. Oh, I thought that that was Yeah, a but that's much closer than the freezer. It's, yeah, it's... Hold on. One, well, we could... Two, three, four, I can't five. believe I'm saying this, but... Uh, split up? We could split up? <laughs> split up? <laughs> you guys want to split up? <laughs> Maybe we should just have the klepto go in there. Trust me, guys. Yeah. Splitting up in mansions, generally not best idea. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Are you done, Gilly? Yes. Okay. So hey, this... what are you guys' dexterities? Mine is five. Five. Dead. Uh, five. Okay. We're all moderately dexterous. <laughs> We're all like the same person, basically. Everything <laughs> is like, oh, it's like the same. We're the mediocre dream team. Yeah. <laughs> what did you guys, where do I see your health at? Is it the uh, it's red? on it's the red die. Yeah, it's the red die. Yeah. Uh, I'm a little weak. I'm weak charging in, guys. All right. I'm searching this so, room. Is that your first move? Yes. Yeah, that's his first move. And to be able to search, you, act you actually have to use another move plus oh, because your action. It's, oh, because, because it's, it's dark, dark there. Wait. Yeah, so you're this is part of the same down. room, though, isn't it? Right. Like, because there's nothing here? Well, no. Technically, this double white line means that you're moving into a new room. Oh, OK. So even there's though it's just a hallway. no brown, yeah. There's no right. brown wall, but this, well, this in that case, well, hold on, happens. no, but I can't, uh, I can't actually do that then. Yeah, you can, because you use your first move to move in, and then your second move plus your action to flip it. No, but I had two moves to move there. Oh, because I was mind. here. Oh, sorry. Oh. Yeah, we'll still search it. Okay. Because yeah. we didn't know. Yeah. Um, I mean, not not during your turn, but during someone else's. Yeah. Do you guys want me to I'll move just, into the I'll next uh -huh. into the next room? Just get out of your way so that way somebody can move here and search yeah that's whatever. true okay good because i my next action could be just to move me in here okay i'll do that all right i'm out Peace. all right Many would you lab. like to go next carolyn yeah. fan sure as soon okay if i land in his well i guess i'm not going to because i need and to you're also not you're, this right 
Yeah. yeah, and you're also not carrying anything he can steal. So. Oh, I put this is after. Okay, yeah. You've oh, he enough? can't steal my um... starting weapon. Uh. Uh-uh. Oh, okay. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's comforting. Yeah. All right. Steal everything else. So I think I'm just gonna run to catch up with you guys. One, two, three. Cool. And I think I'm done. All right. Is that all? Yeah, yep. I think so. What are you doing? Okay, um, I am drawing three threat. I have a question. Uh huh. On a trauma card, if it has a number and somebody has hit that number, do they have to take damage for me to give the trauma card first still? Yeah, so the okay. only way you can give a trauma card is if they take physical or mental damage, but the number is just tells you what they have to be at currently after taking damage. Right. Right. Okay. Hey, Foo Fighters are playing again. It's about time. <laughs> they played last Friday, too. Oh. What? For the ACL Fest. Mm -hmm. Oh. The concert, like, outside our window. Oh. <laughs> um, I think I'm just going to draw one... What is... Uncontrollable urges can't be used. We talked about that to use weapons, correct? Right. It has to be yeah, yeah, an action from one of your spell, equipment, artifact, or tome cards. Does anyone have any of those things? I think so. Um, I, well, I have a flux stabilizer, but that doesn't. No, do I have anything. an artifact and two weapons. Yeah. No. Okay. So yeah, I don't have anything. Oh, actually, his flux stabilizer is an equipment. What does it yeah, do? Yeah, but it doesn't have any use ability on it. Whenever a monster is placed... Oh, the keeper has to place it in a room adjacent. Instead okay. Of that room. I have equipment right. with an action. Does that matter? Yeah, what is that? Mm -hmm. nice. Discard an insanity it? trauma from an investigator in your space. Oh, you could totally come to my space and heal me. <laughs> you, could, oh. you could heal me of, ins of my kleptomania. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know that. I've done <laughs> okay. that already. No, that's all right. Make with the healing. Can okay. I make her? Can I make her use it on herself? Uh, yeah, but she doesn't have a trauma. So wouldn't it just waste a card? Uh, it's it's not a discard, so she can keep. Oh, using she it can keep using it. Yeah. Mm. Dang. So that's okay. her special oh, ability. I didn't know that. We that's are going okay. to be the same. I, I didn't know it either. It once and then I forgot I had it. Cool. So then That's I cool. think what I'm just going to do is draw one of each card and then take an extra tr uh, threat. So I guess I just keep this threat. Oh, yeah, because that's your only action. Yeah. Cool. All right. So then we add another event token. This one's going to take three or another three. Yeah. Right. OK, gang. All right, folks. So step one, I get healed, right? No more Collectomania? Uh, oh, we yeah. Could... Do you want I will take first? your equipment. Yeah. OK. All right, so I'll move in here and then just heal you. That's yeah. your action, yep. And then you have one more movement. After so you can that. still move to there. Uh, well, do I want to? I, I don't think I want to move into the darkness. Oh, I'll discard <laughs> it. Oh. Sorry. That's OK. Maybe. You're already in the darkness, actually. Yeah. The, the whole room is dark, even We're, though... Yeah, that, oh. that can be kind of confusing. You and I are hanging out in the dark. Okay. Uh, well... I don't know it, if I... It probably won't move. make too much of a difference. Okay, I guess I'll nah. move then. It's not like you can steal my shit stuff anymore. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Game so Face, do you want to you... You come in here before I search this room? Or do you want me to... I was thinking I could search this room and then you could move to the laboratory and search oh, that. Okay. Oh yeah, I could do that. Sounds good. Moving to the lab, doing some searching. All right. Gilly, you want to read me this card? Uh, sorry, I'm looking at my. That's okay. That's all right. She might okay. have an interrupt. Yeah, it's hard to. You got the ruby of really. It's really, really good. Ruby. If you spend really. an action to cast a spell, you may take an additional action, not cast the same spell. Uh, be awesome we don't have if any I spells. had spells. <laughs> yeah, maybe we'll get one. 
Sweet. All right. Game okay. face. Yes. You're in a hallway, correct? Yes. Okay. <laughs> no. The hallway in front of you appears to stretch on forever. It is impossibly long. Impossible. Take one horror or allow the keeper to draw stop, two trauma stop. cards. All right. T take one what? Horror or allow me to draw two trauma cards. So how many trauma cards do you have in your hand? Four. So go ahead and draw more, right? Yeah, because she'd have to dis she'll have to discard two, but she gets to choose. So should yes. we let her have a kind of a choice? Sure. Okay. Yeah, why not? Yeah. Hopefully they'll turn up well for us. <laughs> Is that all I had to do? <laughs> yes, Carl. Who knows? She's definitely gonna play that way. <laughs> Maybe she'll draw two that are worse than any of the ones she had. Here's some mercy. <laughs> mercy, mercy. All right. Can Game Face move into the room? Oh, yeah. Yeah, go right ahead. Do whatever right. you need. So I'll uh, move one down <laughs> here, and then I'll explore. Do you have enough movement and stuff? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, because I have one more movement left plus an action, and I'll use those two to explore. Oh, an axe. Hey, we all got weapons. That's what I've been axing for. <laughs> no. What was that, what was that puzzle? Oh, uh, yeah, you can automatically solve a lock puzzle by... Ooh. So if I'd had that Whoa. with the uh, Heck yeah. suitcase, yeah. I'd just smash that you puzzle. You could just <laughs> axe the puzzle. <laughs> yeah, axe it a question. <laughs> no, I was just going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. What are you guys' sanities at? Ten Too still, Too much to mess with. Eight. Yep. Eight. Well, nine. Okay. Sorry, nine. I'm very sane. Yeah, I'm a little wonky. Game face, you have too many weapons. I know. I need to. Sh I need to spread some out. I need to give somebody something. I am overburdened. All right. I think that's the investigator's turn. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yep. Mm -hmm. What kind of horror are you unleashing, Gilly? We'll see. Okay. Let's plunge rooms into darkness. Oh, uh, that's not do what this we want one. to do. All right. Which rooms are you plunging? The uh, operating room, uh, of course. Actually, let's wait. Are you are you plunging the freezer let's into darkness? Plunge the freezer into darkness. Okay. Well. You know that the freezer has its own little light, right? <laughs> that freezer is turning off. <laughs> and then... So I had to test what? You don't have to test anything. You're not in it. I'm in this one. Oh, wait. Oh, you only plunged one room into darkness, which was the freezer. Yeah, but I think I'm going to plunge see. another room into darkness. Okay. You want me to do the laboratory? Or the operating room? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Fine. Now do I test willpower? Yeah. And then I'm going to draw cards. I succeeded. Wait, is it a minus two? It's a minus two. Oh, I failed. <laughs> okay, so you take one horror. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, I'm going to erase my graffiti. Let's plunge the freezer into darkness. <laughs> you know. Okay, and then I drew cards. So again, I'll have to discard a trauma. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Rex, that was me writing that. <laughs> and then yeah. I'm done. So I think we should let Ogre go first to try to get into the locked room and Sounds see good. what he has to go up against. So basically to to figure out what a lock is is you just use your movement to try to move into the room. 
I moved in. All right, so Gilly, I think he's attempting this lock. Dark room. You open the door and see nothing through the pitch blackness. You reach for the light switch, but nothing happens. Place a darkness token in this room, then discard this card. Dang it, I didn't know! <laughs> That's all right. Yeah. Oh, well. It's extra dark. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so now you're in the room, so you've got one move okay. and one action left. So you could, Which means I which can actually be... search? Yeah. Sweet. Okay. Let's do it. Okay, so this is not right. Do not read that. Okay, I'm not okay. reading that one. What you should, for one, you find a brass key. Ah. Yes, is that the brass key that we need for over here? For two, what room is that? The freezer? Mm -hmm. Yes. So just if you tell me the clue, I will read the right one. You have released Ithaca what? <laughs> what? into <laughs> the wild, and the game is over. <laughs> what? What? Just kidding. It okay. is. <laughs> I was like, we can't have done this again. It's, oh. clue, it's clue three. And it should be 3A. Okay, 3A. Now reading 3A. This is what the clue actually says. You find a scrap of notebook paper. On it is written, Amelia, when I left class to get my scarf, I hid a message for you. It's important. The door to the room slams shut. The keeper seeds the padlock door lock card in an adjacent room. Okay. So I think the lock that says padlock lock you put in the laboratory, basically. Oh, okay. So the clue says, when you, you find a scrap of notebook paper, on it is written, Amelia, when I left class to get my scarf, I hid a message for you. It's important. Class. Hmm. hmm. So we'll have to figure out what the classroom is. Maybe the study? Which is up here? Oh, so th that's what the next clue is going to be. Yeah, it gives us a hint as to the next clue's location. Guys, there's a but, furnace room over here. That seems like a likely place for classes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right? It's where Hagrid's classes were. Right? <laughs> um, so, so, so he's done. We So we either can help him unlock this lock, which we don't know what it is yet. Do it. Or we could just leave him. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not that one. Wait, is he you guys need this brass key. Yeah, yeah, see, now there's a lock in this room. Yeah. Oh. And so in order to help him get out... Either you or I have to try to go into that room and see what the lock is. Well, I'll do it. Okay. Sweet. So she's using one movement to tr test the lock. Yeah. Well, All right. Yeah. So it's a movement to test the lock? Does it matter that it's dark in here? And so it's a movement and an action? Is that what it is? Yeah. The door no, it's just, uh, oh, uh, no, it's just a movement. It's oh, just okay. The door leading into this room is sealed with a rusted combination lock. This door is locked. Solve lock puzzle number 4A to discard this card. Okay, so I actually have the right one. All right. This time. Good. You sure you, you, sure you don't want to, like, Hulk smash this lock? <laughs> That's true. But I have to roll a skill check to do it. Oh, yeah, let's just solve it. That's more fun. I mean, it's just a two-part <laughs> lock. This doesn't seem like it could be that bad, right? So there's three locks on either side of it. Uh, let's see. So let me get them out. Let's see. So there's... If somebody wants to rotate them so the arrows are up. Sure. All this right. is the second I'm gonna one. I'm going to make this so that we can actually zoom in on these. Where does where do these go? Oh, so they go in order. I put them in order. So it goes one... Oh, dang it. It goes one, two, and then three. Okay. So how does this kind of lock work? So you just have to get it to where all of them match on all the circles and then the last one that's next to this matches the color of this okay so they have to match in a line right oh i see oh well this one's lucky oh that's good okay hey, keep going face. with that luck. they actually have to start with the arrows pointing up. oh dang uh -huh. <laughs> okay well. what were you gonna say gilly uh it's still not bad. i plunged the stream into darkness is the stream <laughs> down oh no <laughs> i i fixed it Oh, okay. So I, I made it so that the stream is full screen the game so that we they can get a good view of what the puzzle is. Oh, okay. Um, I have a question about a card. Yeah. Can I put it in your hand and you tell me? Yeah. Can I play that at any time during the thing or does it have to be at the beginning of somebody's turn? Um, so probably what you want to do is you want to wait and see if it if it ha if it gets done during her turn if it doesn't 
then play that card. So I can't do it mid her turn? Okay. That's what I was asking. Um... No, see. you have to wait until her action is done. Okay, that's she what I wanted play. to know. Yeah, yeah, you can't that's play cool. it in the middle of an action. Yeah. So, are my moves for this lock intellect? Intellect, yeah. And then you can always spend a skill point to I add your luck six. to it. Alright, and it's it costs how many to swap pieces? Uh, in order to swap two that are right next to each other, it only costs one. Oh, it only costs but one. But to okay. swap them out, it's... Well, I don't cheap. think I need to swap them out. Okay, so I'm going to rotate this one. Oh, how do I quickly rotate something? Uh, Q and E. Oh, okay. Mm, yeah. No. Mm. Oh, my God. I'm the... Okay. That... <laughs> That's good. We got, we got it. it. We got it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, so down one. Okay. And then I need to swap these two. Four. Oh, sorry. I was trying to be helpful. It's okay. Um, all that's right, so that's here. one. Okay, and then I need to swap this this way. Or rotate. Yeah. Oops. So that's another one. Okay, and then this one too. Nice. Oops. Yeah. Whoa. Sick life. Wow, Unlocked. is that the whole thing? Yep. Dang. <laughs> Look at that. Woo! Lock puzzles, yo. We get that. You like my squid? <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> nice Cthulhu. <laughs> yes. It's not green, though. I was sad. <laughs> All right. So um, so basically, you're in the room, and you, ha you still have a movement left and an action, actually, because it didn't cost an action to solve the puzzle. Oh, OK. Um, I don't think there's much she can do, though. Yeah. Unless she wants to start leaving. Yeah, I guess yeah. I can start leaving. You could Are always you move get up here. By something? Since you've only no. Nah. Im... Oh no, I think he's okay unless she plays some kind of surprise card. Okay, so I um, guess I'll just come back up here. Yeah, and then I can give you a weapon. Wait, yes. do I have two movement? Oh, I'm using yes. my action. You're as using a the other action, right? Yeah. Right. All right. Yes, running. Wee. So just to, just to recall, this brass key that I have was the thing to the. The closet room, down right. here. This, yeah. yeah, the first closet. So mm. we got to go all the way back there to open that? Yeah, that's true. But the one thing I'm wondering is maybe one person or two of us should go to try to look at the study and mm. see if that's where the next clue is. I'm worried about, like, speed. Yeah. But I also worry about separating. <laughs> I know. And death. <laughs> and I have a lot death. of worries. Well, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that, like, it's just probably just going to be an item in there, right? It's not going to be, like, a clue for Sometimes the Sometimes the key from one clue room is the key to the next clue room, though. Oh, I see. All right, yeah. How about I'll just run back and get that, and then you can, you guys can. You want us to move ahead? Yeah. Okay. We'll split up. Fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no big deal. I've, I've got a shotgun and That's a flux true. capacitor or yeah. stabilizer. <laughs> That's true. What's the flux capacitor to do? It makes it so that the keeper can't place monsters in my room. Oh, okay. That well, that's good. That's really yeah. good. It's okay. good for me. Yeah. All right. So that's so I haven't gone yet, right? I think you two have right. gone. Right. Yeah, you haven't gone yet. Okay. Yeah. All right. So I'll go ahead and move one, two, three, and then I'm done. Oh wait, I was gonna give you a weapon. Yeah. Oh, well. Um. Hmm. What do you guys oh. think? I think we're in three different places now. Yeah, it's that doesn't. It's fight. Fine. Yet. <laughs> All right, Let's I'll move, guys. <laughs> I'll, stay, I'll stay here. Let me see if I can do this skull as my action. I get to test my luck, which is a two. So this is not going to be an easy roll. Wait, but hold on. Isn't it, wait, okay. Well, now it's now it's out. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh yeah. Say, if you it's fail, zero, actually. If you oh, yeah. I didn't see that. Yeah. You Oops. failed it. Did you fail it? Yeah, yeah. like really hard. How much? Sorry. Two. Four. Four. Yay! <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't see that. 
<laughs> I didn't realize what I did. <laughs> the skull just wanted me to rub it. <laughs> does it go away or does it stay? No, it stays. That's a permanent thing? Yeah. Well, Wait. She, she gets that fourth Hold on. threat, but, it, but we can test our lore again later. Hold on. Hold on. What? Oh, my lore is also plus two. This but... is incredibly broken. What? Because she can force us to, or force you to use a ceremonial skull that gives no, her threat. No, it has threat. to be equipment. It, that's an artifact. Yeah. yeah. It, oh, I thought it included it. artifacts Trust in that me, list. Trust me, buddy. I've looked at it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, right, it says was... artifact? Yeah, it says artifact. Yeah. Uh-oh. It says artifact. Oh, I thought I couldn't with artifacts. Thanks, Carl. Mm. Thanks for calling your attention to that, Carl. <laughs> oh, but I could use an action to drop next time. I can use an action to drop an item in my space. Yeah. So we can just drop it and get rid of it. Yeah, drop that. Drop Carl, it good. Get in the house, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Damn. My turn? Yes. Yes. Are you going to trade items? Uh, Give Jeb the like? ceremonial skull. Give me that, give me that, <laughs> give me that skull, baby. Actually, <laughs> you'll be better at luck test than I will be, so I should give it to you. Can you trade yep. multiple items? Yes. Okay, good. So, yeah, give her that skull. <laughs> do you also want a sledgehammer or an axe? The sledgehammer requires ah. that her strength be high. That kills people, Carl. All right, no. so my strength, what's your strength? Your strength. Ooh, I keep crossing the board <laughs> to go look at stuff. Game face is five. Mm -hmm. Debs is four. four. So okay. she should we'll get the her, axe. I'll give you the axe. And then, so we should be good on items. Give him the axe. Give him the axe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's executioner. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Julie. <laughs> All right, awesome. so... <laughs> it's back to you, Gilly. Did okay, we I already a, drew my threat. Did we put an event token last time it was your turn? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. What are you doing? What does this four thing in red mean on this weapon? Is that how much damage it does? Uh, yeah, if you hit. Mm -hmm. What kind of a check do you do for that? Um, it depends on... I'm just going to draw a card. So Gilly plays a combat it. card, and it'll tell you what to test whenever you're fighting a monster. It could. It's usually strength if it's a melee weapon, but it can also be something else like dexterity or something else. So like if it's a puzzle... You would test your strength. Oh, okay. And if you hit it, then you could destroy a lock puzzle and automatically oh. solve it. Yeah. Neato. Um, I just, I drew the cards and then had the threats. Oh my goodness. Look at all that threat. Yeah. Very threatening. Much darkness. <laughs> Very Much threatening. Darkness. So is that it? Yep. Or are you going to do actions? I'm good. Wow. That Fun doesn't that. sound good. So there's another event token. All right. One, two, three. I'm just running out. My turn's easy. Okay. I should Carl, have what's your hit points at? Nine. Are you guys okay with me being extra mean to you guys since Deb is the new person, or do you want me to spread it out evenly? Uh, fine. Yeah, that's fine. I'm Joe Diamond. I My middle name is Danger. Okay. And my first name is Carlos. <laughs> it's really Joe Diamond. Carlos, Joe Diamond. <laughs> Whispered voices drift down the halls. Their chanting becomes louder and louder. You cover your ears and start banging your head against the wall to take to get the voices out. Take one horror and one damage. If affected by a darkness token, take one additional horror. Ah, uh, who is that? Me or that's that. me. Oh, right. Yeah. 
What is... Hold on. I'm gonna throw this on you too, sorry. On me as well? Yeah. Concussion, grabbing while slowly shaking your head. What happened? You're eight now, right? Mm -hmm. Want to buy pentacle? <laughs> what? Elder sign. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, you guys are drawing. <laughs> so, so over oh, us to discard one skill point when receiving the card, and it's minus two intellect to a minimum of one. I'm sorry, Ogre. Guys, I was originally going to play it on Dev, but then I feel bad playing stuff on Dev. <laughs> Don't feel bad playing stuff on me. It's part of the game. Yeah. Thanks, All right. more Elder Sign. Next time you can kill me, dude. Wait, okay. what? So what did you do? What concussion? Yeah. yeah. So I have, I have. Oh, physical is that a trauma. physical thing? That's yeah, a physical that's trauma. Physical. Dang it! Can't yeah. heal that one. So I've, yeah. My intellect is a four I'm now. Avoiding the intellect. Dang. Okay, oh. you're. I'm. You're next, Deb. You're next. Okay. All right. You want to go next, or do you want me to? Well, I don't care either way. Yeah, I guess our turns are going to be pretty easy because I can only move one, two, three, and that's it. Yeah. Uh, we don't want to go figure out what's in the furnace room. I think it's possible it could be a lock that we need to open a pre, like an earlier clue first. Yeah, since we don't have a clue there, I think going there might. Yeah, this game's pretty know. story driven, so it's like oh okay. when it when it when it is explaining something to you or like hits in something then usually you want to go there unless it's the freezer right okay <laughs> yeah. we already went to the freezer yeah and it was okay this time and it was actually okay this time <laughs> we got over our freezer phobia <laughs> <laughs> okay. all right so i think we're done again okay do you gonna trade items uh no i think we should be good yeah Um, I'm going to plunge this room into darkness. So do we both have to test? Yes. Willpower, right? Yes. Any modifiers? Um, well, it's dark, so I don't know if the darkness comes first or... Uh, I think so. I think it does. Because it, does it say place a token and then test? Action, place a token, a darkness token in any room. Each investigator currently yeah. affected by darkness. Oh, wait. Mm -hmm. Probably just in that room, right? Yeah. Not everywhere? Not it everywhere. Says, it says each investigator currently affected by darkness must test willpower. Oh, no, that is everybody that's in a dark room. Oh, Son oops. of a... We've been playing that wrong. Oops. That's all right. All right. Okay, test so I got to get a seven. Oh, okay. Whew. And it's and at a minus two penalty, two. right? Yeah, so I actually had to okay. get a five. So I got to get a four. Which I do. Giant dice for the mine's win. A, mine's a six, so I have to get a four under. Is that right? Right. right. Mm. I should have used giant that's, dice. That's not a... That's a nine. Yeah. <laughs> so what happens to me? You lose you a, sanity. A, whole, a sanity. Oh, okay. Well, I got a lot of that. What is it? E or Q? Q, Q? Q is down and okay. E is up. Alright. And then... I will also plunge the study into darkness. Wait, is that another... We got to test again. No. Oh, yeah, you guys My will have to title. test again. Ah. Sorry. Sorry, not that seems, sorry. That seems crazy. That's sorry, everywhere. not sorry. But yeah, yeah but eventually, it's in darkness. It's not eventually getting any darker. Rooms, yeah, there, there'll be the rooms will all be filled with darkness. Yeah, that's true. Oh, I did not roll that very well. Yeah, well, I missed seven. So what do I take? Do I take an insanity or something? Yeah. Oh, I got a four. Yes. Four is... Perfect. What are you guys at? Five, at seven. And she's eleven. Okay. All right. And then I will draw. Actually, yeah, I'll draw cards. Oh, no. Okay. 
What is happening over here? Is this blood? Is it bleeding? Oh god. <laughs> Can you, you guys are creeping me out over here. <laughs> You're destroying <laughs> us, so... <laughs> okay, done. They're going All insane. Right. Done destroying. What is it? What is, okay. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> it's pixel art splatter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm. I'll, my turn's really easy again. I'm just moving. All right, one, two, three. I'm piecing out of this mansion. <laughs> <laughs> just right back the way we came. Okay, so would you like to explore this room for this card, or do you want me to? Um, you can go ahead and do that. All right. So that cost me an action and a movement. Oh, look at that. We found a lantern. Yes. Okay, good. Oh, so basically, cool. we can ignore darkness effects. Does that only work for the person carrying it? Or it works for everybody room? in the room. Oh, okay. Sick. So as long as we stay in the same room, we should be good. Neat. And then I've got... So what I'm wondering... Oh, no. I think I use my action no matter what and a movement. So I only got one movement left, so I'll move over here. So then that way you won't be affected by that darkness in this room since we're moving up here. Nice. So. So last thing is for Deb to move up there? Yeah. Okay. Oops, I gotta switch my hand back. So that's one, and then you can move two and explore that card. You can't because the darkness. Oh, wait, yeah, never mind. Yeah, because I got my lantern. That's right, that's right. Oh. I right. need your electricity. Any? Yep. Oh, it's another puzzle. Our power failure. The lights in this room refuse to turn on. Place a darkness marker in your room. Solve wiring puzzle 1A to discard this card and the darkness marker to continue exploring this room. All right, puzzle us. All right, I'm finding the right one. I'm like the puzzle master over here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you got this. But puzzles. your intellect's minus two, right? Don't forget. Wait, why is it minus two? Because of that card I gave her. Oh. Wait, no, you gave me that. Oh wait, card. I give that to you. Yeah. Dang it. She is Perfect. solving this puzzle with maximum intellect. No. Okay. So one one A you said right? Uh. Ooh, this is a yes. different kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> She's so. Oh, I love <laughs> these puzzles. I know they're the Aren't best they cool? part. Okay, and then I gotta grab the fuses, so it should be a three by two, right? Yes. And there should be an arrow that points up on each one of these. So there's one. This is two. Okay, so the color of the the wires have to match? Yeah, you got to make a completed circuit all the way through. From the beginning start to the end. Okay. All right. This looks just and like what I learned in electrical moves. engineering. Okay. Right? Your intellect six. Okay. One. Is somebody gonna count? Or, okay. But, um. And then. Uh. <laughs> so lucky. Oh yeah. my god. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Nice. <laughs> okay. Ready and go. <laughs> ready and done. Victory. <laughs> So you All right. think it's just this token, right? No, actually, um, it still should stay there, I think, right? That thing said discard it, but I don't know. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. You're right, I'm sorry. And you get De Vermis Mysteris. I don't know if that's how you say that. Sounds good to me. What is it, do? De Vermis it's Mysteris, a yeah. tome, and if you can solve the tome or whatever, like learn it, then you get a spell from it. Yeah, so you spend one of your actions to try to mm -hmm. test it and read the book, basically. And if you pass, you get a spell, which is kind of awesome. Man. Okay. I think it might be a healing spell. Oh, that would be the greatest. Yeah. I can give somebody uh, the Ruby of Relay. But you have to take a horror, too. Yeah, if you Yeah, because, yeah, because it's scary you're book. learning more about the mysteries of the universe. Yeah, so horror, so spell casting is always, uh, lead to, that always leads to insanity in this game. Yeah. That is true. That is true. <laughs> Literally. So the horror is just losing one sanity? Yeah. Oh, okay. Which you have a lot of. Yes, I do. Okay, so... Keep it that way. <laughs> I don't want to go sacking my 
intellect all over the place. <laughs> yeah. I think we're done. Yep. We did not find a clue, so the clue is probably going to be where it's going to be revealed. Saying. Yeah, hopefully. Okay, so are you going to trade anything? Uh, I think we're good. Oh yeah, we're all in separate Wait, spaces. weren't you going to drop the ceremonial skull? Oh yes, but that Can takes an do... action. Oh, it takes that an action to drop something. Yeah. What is yeah, this? The actions over oh, here. we can just drop it and get rid of it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. But she can she can make us test it if she wants to. I don't really want to give you guys skill points and like a free way of. But rather as just... if that's well, actually yeah. now that now there's another word on darkness, it's much better. I have a much more fun better. plan for you okay. guys than making okay. you guys. Hmm. Okay. Um, oh, were we supposed to do an event card last time? No, there's one this time. There's one this okay. time. Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to plunge a room into darkness. Which one, you might ask? Uh, I want to plunge the coat. Actually, let's start with the gallery. And then we all have to test again, right? Can't. Did I just pay? I don't think I did. You guys don't have to, but Ogre does. Pay what? You guys have the lantern. Oh, that's oh, right. Oh, yeah. That's oh, right. right. I got to roll for a thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and you're, But you're not in a dark room, though, so you should... Oh, you are. <laughs> yep, nine. I, I super failed it anyway. All right, so you're now at four, correct? Yep. Yeah. You are claustrophobic. Each time you end your turn in a room that contains only one space, take one horror. Oh, all right. Good thing oh, so you're closet. going for that closet. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. It's okay. That's how it worked out over, I promise. I will get this no matter what. <laughs> Wait, is that a mental thing? Yeah. It is. So yeah. why don't you just come back to me and get healed? Because you're close enough that that's not a huge yeah. waste of time, right? That sounds good. I'll just meet you and then heal you. Yeah. But don't tell Kelly. Okay. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Um. Now, how do you get rid of your lantern? <laughs> so actually, do you have to have a monster with you? Yeah, it's an equipment. So I can, you can make me discard it to deal three damage to a monster within one range. But if there's not a monster there, then can I make you just use it even though there's no monster or no? Uh -uh. I think okay. it has to have a monster. That's what I figured. Yeah. For now, you can have that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> if I put not, like your lantern tokens don't take darkness tokens off, right? You just ignore them? Right. Okay. Right. And for now, as long as you have that, I'm just going to wait. Because I can use darkness as much as I want in one turn. And I did what I wanted to with Ogre. I have plenty of cards. Actually, I will... I'll draw cards, and then that's going to be it. So let's go ahead and do the... Well, I'll draw the cards in, but then I'll decide which one I'm going to get rid of. Okay. After we do the event. Next card. All right, here we go. Fire shoots out from the furnace, engulfing the room in flames. Place a fire token in the furnace room. Wait, that's not quite right. Hold on. Mm -hmm. I don't think that that's right. You could just let me look at my choices. I'm sorry, that was incorrect. The correct thing I should have read was, the temperature in the freezer plummets at an alarming rate. Each investigator in the freezer is dealt two damage and loses one skill point. Oh, thank God we weren't there. No. Oh. So right, you guys are keeping, you're keeping ahead of the pace of the game. Which oh is yeah, that's nice. So we're, yeah. so the mm. events usually give us a good idea of how much we're sucking. So we're not sucking too <laughs> much. Yeah, you're keeping ahead of it, which is really, really good. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, why do we have so much spam in chat today? I don't know, it's weird. Oh, it's like all over Twitch. It's just been absolutely ridiculous. Can you do something, Cthulhu? Yes, <laughs> attack the spam in chat. Okay, I'm done. I'm just looking through my cards to see what I have to discuss. All right, so are we meeting back up, or do you think... 
ogre should run for the room or well what I mean, happens with the claustrophobia i would only so, take one damage one so, horror or one one horror maybe two if i have to solve a puzzle or something hmm. he is down to four. Oh, and actually this room's in darkness as well so yeah, maybe if you guys need, maybe you guys should. Meet oh, me somewhere. actually, there won't be a puzzle because all you have to do is explore, and you can automatically unlock the. Yeah, it's just a lock. Right, but I have to go to another room in darkness, which right. means that but she's going to plunge something else into darkness, which is going to make me test yeah. it again. So I'm going to lose another sanity. Wait, yeah. it's just each time you end your turn in a room that only has one space. Right. No, it's also every time he's not with you guys in the lantern, I'm going to plunge oh, another oh. room in darkness. Oh, and make him lose. Horror. Yeah, why don't we just go with him? So we could meet here. Yeah, let's this do that. is the furthest we can move. Okay. And then I can move one, two, three. Sweet. Actually, I think you can just move here, Deb. But oh, there's still over there. Yeah. Oh, we're oh, still yeah, in the same one, room, though. Two, three. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, so you still get the lantern. Okay. Cool. All right. You guys scared of the dark? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Okay, so now it's my turn again. Are you guys yes. trading anything? Uh, I don't think so. Do you guys need to trade anything? No. No, but don't. Do yes. I have to be on oh. the same? Oh, he's gonna steal space? the lantern from. Me. Oh wait, no, he doesn't have. No, I don't have though. Should I? Should I take? Do the I have key? to be in the same space to do that? Um. The healing, healing thing? thing? Yes. Oh, dang. Can I take we the need... key since you have claustrophobia and then I could get in the closet? Oh, yeah. That's a good idea. Okay. Uh, wait, do you have the spell book as well? No, uh, she does. Okay. Does. Then never mind. Berger makes a good point. He could just take the lantern, but then the other two are testing willpower. Mm -hmm. Let's just all go. It's fine. Yeah. It's better in a group. So I'm going to choose an investigator, and that's the person with the lantern. Well, oh. That's you, right? Yeah. Move you in. Wait, that's Oh, me. that's me. Into me there, down. and then I'm going to plunge a room into darkness. Oh, sorry, guys. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I just felt this need to go into the... <laughs> Uh, let's go with the coat room. Okay. Oh, yeah! Is that a zero? Oh, but that's a ten. That's zero a ten. is a ten, actually. Oh. Welcome to the world of D10s. <laughs> Alright, I pass. Sorry. Right. Dang. I was so excited. I was <laughs> like, that's literally the best thing that could not happen. Man. So you just take one sanity. Oh, okay. I always get excited about that too, and then I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> Why couldn't you put a one? All right. Okay, oh, that's my this turn. isn't a countdown one. I got it. Oh, oh interesting. Thanks. All right. So, um, I can move first, and then that way you guys know how far you can move. So, I'll move one, two, three. Deb, if you want, you could also just it's move just two and try to test and see if you can get that spell, if you want, as your action. You could also go up here and here. Yeah, that's true. We could also... Why don't, else... why don't I do this? Go here, heal him, and then... Yay. Move. Okay. That sounds good. I think that's more selfless. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. No more claustrophobia. Yeah, that's a... Silly thing to have. Oh, it came back. <laughs> you threw it off. Maybe. No, don't. Goodbye. Forever. All okay. right. And I'm just going to move to here to hang out with you. All right. So now we are... I think we're finished with our turn. Okay. Are you going to trade anything? Uh, no, I think we're good, right? Yeah, it's the same setup we just had, so... Yeah. Wait, actually, what is your, um... Yeah, if my sanity gets much lower, I need to take the lantern, but... Uh, let's go ahead and give it to you, then, just in case. Okay. I don't mind testing mine for a little while. 
Darkness. <laughs> what is that from? So that's wait, but that's the that's horror, like yeah. Right? League, yeah. Yeah. It's um, what's his name's alts. I know who you're talking about. Yeah. I've got um. So this like once per game thing is that like my ultimate ability? Oh yeah, you get to do that once per game. What is it? Okay, it's pretty decent. Don't let Gilly read it though. I get to read everything. So, <laughs> <laughs> well, everyone, put your hands on it. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Yeah, it's, uh, you can take any number of horror, and then for each horror that you take, you can heal other investigators. Not um, in your room by four. Oh, sweet. Yeah. yeah. So if you get like super low, just stay by me, and I'll heal you. I'm super low. Oh, how low are you? But you have to use oh, an this action to do it. And this is once yeah, per game. So next, okay, never yeah. mind. So I mean, I'm at four. Seven. That's pretty low, though, buddy. Yeah, it's all right. We can we can hang on for just a little bit. Because right. I can take like I can take two, bring me down to eight, and get you back up. Get put like give you eight. I think that's not a bad deal. I think I don't know. And you'd be at twelve, and then I'd just be chilling at eight. Wait, can I heal myself though? That's the question. Um, no, I think. Let's see. Are these so these are the choose, reveal clue cards, right? It says choose an investigator in your room to heal for four horror. That doesn't say yeah. I can't do it to myself. That's true. Yeah. That's kind of a little broken. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think I'll just do the same thing I did last time, which is move the person with the lantern. Yay! Bye. To here, and then plunge a room into darkness. All right, so I gotta get. Oh, which room do you want to do? I'll do the bathroom. Actually, do. Uh, yeah, that's. I'll, I'll move it. I'll okay, so I gotta get. Uh, five. That's really weird. Ah, that right. seems really powerful. I don't understand. I don't think it's supposed to apply to yourself. Yeah, I th I don't think so either because then it's just unlimited. What? Well, it's, no, it's not it's unlimited because you oh, can only, you can only do, do it once per game. Yeah. You See, can I only do it um, with the ceiling is your sanity, which my sanity is twelve, but my sanity right now is ten, so I'd be able right. to do it ten times. Uh, well, up but... to a maximum of twelve. Yeah, and we can't go over our starting sanity. Oh, I see. Yeah, so you'd only be able to go back up to 12, and then that would be it. Are you guys doing your checks at a disadvantage with darkness? Uh, yes, I've been subtracting two. Oh, yeah, Deb has to do her check. Deb has to do oh, her check. Oh, for darkness? darkness? Yeah. yeah. Oh, again? Okay. Don't roll a zero. Four. Yeah, a once per game should be an OP, I agree. It's a zero. Oh, man. Again. Zero is like you. Yeah. I liked them too until I realized they were evil. <laughs> well, at least your once per game will be good. It'll heal you completely. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Okay, I'm done. What do you guys have for so once So we've got another games? event token. Read your stuff. I'm outside the room, you guys. Get in here. I can't see through hands. One, two, three. Okay. Game when you a oh, card. Deb's not gonna make it. What? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna move there instead. I'm not gonna make what? I'm not gonna make it into the room? Yeah, if you move, this is the maximum you can move here. Yeah. And Why did we do that? Why did we split up? It's it's just temporary. I think we got to start running as fast as we can. <laughs> we're yeah, fine. At the end of my next turn, we're gonna have another event card. Yes, yeah, so we yeah. might. I've successfully slowed you down. Actually, I have no freaking clue because I don't know what's in this. Yeah. Okay. And Do you want me to just chill since I'm not gonna like I'm just gonna have to do it. Game face. Do you think I should do this? Use my once. So I have the opportunity now to use my once per game. I think we should wait till we have 
So the next Another, one? Another, yeah, at okay. least one more. All right. I don't like that very much. Aha! Right. Uh -huh. It's still a check, at least. What's yeah. yours? Where, where's your character thing? It's right here. It's, so uh -huh. mine is once per game, you may test your luck. And in this case, it would be test six. And if I pass it, then I we can read the objective card. But you get more for every clue card that's passed, so the closer that you get. Yeah. yeah. So the end of her next turn. So I guess my next turn, I'll probably use it. Which means these are not clue cards. These are not clue cards. What? You you've the gotten one... one clue card. Yeah. It was the so I left you a note. Oh, is that? Yeah, it? these are like event yeah. things. Oh, then let's yeah, just go okay. ahead and use it. Let's yeah. just use it. But There's no let's point wait in waiting. Until we find, wait, I think we're about to find, until you one find another, one. another clue because it's much better for you. It'd be plus four then instead of plus two. I'm saying this as a like yeah, this is a but smart the, plan, not no, as a no, I don't want you no. to. No, no, between this between the second. There's only three clues, right? Right. Uh, and between the second and third clue. Wait, like, Gilly, are there four? There's four tokens out here. There are. You found clue three. Right. Oh, so there are only four. Okay. Or three, I'm sorry. There That's are weird. only three. I made okay. four choices. That's weird. But hmm. there's only three clues. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So... I mean, yes, it would be better to wait. Well, why don't we just but, wait? I don't know. Just... Because by the time you reveal number two, like... You're so close to the end anyway, you might as well just finish it. Like, this isn't going to give us a huge advantage. You might actually give us you're an almost, advantage You're almost, you're like one turn away from just getting it. Potentially. If it's in <laughs> here. Mean, well, that, that's what you have the key for it, right? Oh, that's true. I mean, yeah. okay, maybe, okay, so here's the thing. Maybe just try that. And then if you don't get it, if it's, the clue's not there, then you can do it. But like, it seems like it's going to be a really big waste of your once per game. I don't know, Gilly's do really intent on getting us in that I know. Oh That's God. suspicious about this. I told you, I'm like, her. I'm doing it from a friend's perspective. We need to not, not be me. in the cloak closet when whoever opens this thing opens it. Is what okay. I'm saying. I think I should. I, I don't know what's in there. there. <laughs> I don't know Through the clues, and I don't know. I don't know the clues, and I don't know the events, guys. All right, guys, we're turning around. Works. We're going the other direction. Forget the coat closet. Yeah, forget <laughs> the clue. Let's All just right. go to the furnace room because we already know that's not going to light on fire. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, decide what you're going to do so that we can continue on with the game. Please. So, Deb, are you going? I'm just going to move. Oh, jeez. What the heck? I'm going to move here. Okay. And are you doing it, Carl, or no? No. Game face, okay. I'm going to give you the key. I already, already Okay, I got okay. it. Okay. Yeah, well, I got it. Last time. All right. Okay, done. are we done? Okay. Yeah, we're done. Yep. yep. Are you trading? Oh, wait, that was your trading. Um, let's see. Oh, my gosh, my okay. I guess I'll plunge. Uh, no, I'm gonna wait. I'm done. No more plunging. Yeah. All right, so we have an event card. All right. We do? Yep. Yeah. There were two tokens, I just discarded them. All right, hold on. Which is it? Voices can be heard in the gallery. You're too worried. We didn't summon anything. Place two witches in the gallery. Oh, but you can't. Flux capacitor, yo. It so just can't be I... space, right? Or is it the room? Wait, I think it's the room. Oh, yeah. So where do I put them? Yeah. An adjacent room, so this one. Yep. Ah! <laughs> or, Why can't I put them in, in this here. one? You can, yeah. You can put them in here, too. Okay. <laughs> so the witches are in the, or the, all the monsters are in these bags here. So we know that they're in there, though? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know. I haven't decided where I want to put them yet. 
The witches are here. Oh god. They're in the big one. Let's see. What do, so what do those do? What's the minus two and what's the one mean? So well, in order to do... Um, every time they come into our room, we have to do a horror check. Okay. Um, Which means what? Uh, so what that means is we have to roll a willpower minus whatever is in the bottom right corner. Okay. And if we fail, then we take that much damage. The upper right sanity damage. damage. Okay. No, we, we just take one sanity damage. Oh. So what's so, the minus two? So actually, you have to do two horror checks right now because they just appeared in your room. Uh, okay, so it's the minus two, though, in the top corner? The minus two is if you want to try to move through them without fighting them or take an oh. action if they're in your space. So if I... How do I kill them? So you'll have to use your weapon. Since you have a melee weapon, you'll have to move into their space and use your action to attack them. But I can only attack one of them? Right. It's my turn? Okay. Right. But so we'll right now, though, I have to... Yeah, we're all going to help, though. To check. Yeah. So I have to... What do I have to roll, then? So right now, you're rolling the horror check, which is the bottom right number. So you add that to your willpower, and you have to roll equal to or greater than that. But but then you have to subtract two because of the darkness. So, so it's less one. than or equal to five? So it's just minus one, right. Okay. Yeah, so you want to roll a five or less. All right. Mm. Twice. Do it. Come on. <laughs> no. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right, I think this die is broken. Oh, <laughs> oh. all right. Oh, my so God. Sanity. Okay. Also, I'm never touching that die again. <laughs> yeah, that one's... Mm -hmm. It's it's getting deleted from the game. I'm just going to use this one instead. Bye. All right. So... So now it's our turn. Um, I could go ahead and just run into the closet and get that taken care of. Okay. Yeah. One, two. Since you guys have a shotgun and a sledgehammer or an axe. Heck yeah. And then my... Oh, I don't have the lantern anymore, though. Oh, so you're in darkness there? Yeah, so I can't open it yet. Why not? Well, can't you have him Does go with you? it cost an action and a movement? Oh, shoot. So, wait, can, do you want to fight instead? Uh, I can, but I I also have the key. Oh, right. <laughs> oh, no. Well, that's a so problem. So why don't you guys just both go in the wait, coat room? Can you just, can you just drop chill. it, and then I can pick it up? That would be my action, though. Can you? Well, yeah, but you can't do anything else. I could go okay. in here and fight. Which is oh, weird. and then we do it after? Okay, yeah, let's yeah. do that. Do we want to fight first? Yeah. I mean, no, we I have, have to. Know. We can't, oh, we can't actually, not. I, I can shoot in an adjacent room, I think. Yeah. Sweet. So if we're going to go in and fight, I'm just going to go into the... Well, I, if I go into the room, I take a horror check. Mm -hmm. Do I want to do that, or do I just want to shoot where I am? I'll just shoot where you are. Are you yeah. you're I get not gonna hit Carl though, right? I could get plus yeah, two. Yeah, you can't. There's no friendly fire in this game. Mm -hmm. Thank you goodness there are games that have it and it's yeah. stupid. It's yeah, worst. like Zombie Side has that. Yep. Yes. Yeah, that's the one. That's the exact one we were thinking yeah, of. Yeah, that's the, the dumbest friendly fire. Okay. Yeah, it's like always hit your friend first. Yeah, I yeah. know. Yeah. Can anybody aim? Can I at least have a chance of hitting something else first? Nope. <laughs> okay. Um I'll I'll just fire from here. I'm gonna fire my uh, my 45 automatics into the next room. Feeling full of daylight. <laughs> hey, hey, man! So, <laughs> Gilly, uh, you pull a human card here. I haven't shuffled these yet. And oh, then I you do read, this. Yeah, and then you you draw until you get one that says ranged attack. Uh, okay. Dang it. Right, because the attacks themselves are actually themed. It's not yeah, just the, random. Yeah, the fight is really cool. Ranged weapon. Right before you pull the trigger, your opponent screams and charges you. Test willpower. Ah. Oh. I know. That is the problem with this. <laughs> I love I the attack. Willpower attacks. seven, but unfortunately I'm in a dark room. No, oh, we have lantern. Okay, so yeah, I have a lantern. Zero. Nope, six. Awesome. Uh, okay, good. Got it. Okay, you passed? Yeah. yeah. 
You coolly fire into its chest. Deal weapon damage. Boom, boom. Okay, three. Which one are you uh, attacking? Uh, I'll attack this one. Uh, it's the heart, right? Yeah. Okay. I think it's the heart. Yes. So, um, do I tell you how much damage she has left? No, no. I don't, right? Uh, okay. You have to, yeah. So she is, let me get hard sealed. Um, she is still alive. What? She's got three damage, though? Yes. I put it, I'm going to put them in here. Okay. All right, so um, unless I want to move, do we all want to move into the room together? Since that way so we, we can all be fun. light? Yeah. Uh, oh, but we'll have to take a horror check. We'll have to we take can. horror checks, and I can't do that. So I'm going to stay here, and I have okay. a lantern. All right. <clears throat> okay, I guess I'll just attack into the room as well. Okay. I've got a shotgun. And so I can attack through a door. Mm -hmm. All right. So another ranged attack. Another ranged attack. Ily. Okay. Okay. You fire into the air, aiming to scare your foe. Test intellect. Oh, good. Oh. It's four. Oh no, it's six. I thought. No, because of concussion. Yeah, he has a. Concussion. Oh, you're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> and I failed really hard. Your enemy yells out in defiance. No effect. So let's um, discard pile. I guess. Try and scare you with the shotgun. <laughs> yeah. <it's, it's laughs> the attack Through the door. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. So Carolyn. Okay. So time out before she goes. What does a stun mean again? So on a monster or an investigator? An investigator. So that means that the next time the investigator takes an action, they have bi uh, minus one movement, and they have a minus two to every attribute test. That's on top of darkness. Okay, so I'm going to use this. Wait, are we in a hallway still? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you need to test your dexterity, Deb. You run frantically down the hallway from some oh, unseen evil only to lose your footing. I'm pretty sure we see the evil, <laughs> although although I guess the, it is dark in the hallway. So. Yeah. <laughs> is there, are there any... Modifiers on this, or is it just the straight five? No, it would uh, be minus it, two, right? Because yeah, you're in darkness. Be, yeah, it'll be minus two. Okay, well, that fails. Okay, so you are stunned. So that means the next time it's your turn, you can only take one Wouldn't action. Wouldn't that be this turn? Yeah. Okay. So you can do one action, which means you can move into the space with him if you want and attack them, but it's going to be at a minus four. I'd say I it's thought still I, I thought try. I already went. No, you just... You it's the start of your turn. Oh. You haven't gone yet. Horror... So, basically, monsters attack you in two ways. The first is every time you go into a room with them, immediately, or if they come into a room with you, so anytime you are in a room with a monster, you have to see if it scares you enough to, like, make your sanity go down. And then you get into the physical fight. That's how all Arkham games work when it comes to monsters. Yeah. Okay. So right so, now you have a full turn, but you have one less movement because of the stun, and then your skill checks are going to be at minus four. But I say it's still worth it to trying to attack the witch if you can with your sledgehammer. I have to move, so I have to move into that. Yeah. Thing with them. And then. And then, am I allowed to move in with them because they have yep. that minus two crap? Yep. Okay. You just don't have any movement points left, but that's that's fine. Hmm. So now you can, if you want, you can attack with your axe. So it's a melee, sharp melee? Right. Okay, so if it's just melee, is that all? Yeah, you, you read it if it's melee. Okay. You parry a blow from your foe and then thrust. Text, test dexterity plus one. So it would be dexterity minus one, right? Uh, dexterity, well, technically it would be dexterity minus three still because... No, this says dexterity plus one. Right. So she's got a minus four modifier right now because of the darkness plus the stun. Oh, okay. So yeah. she would actually be at a minus dexterity three. Dexterity minus three. Yeah. So what's my dexterity? Five. So you have to roll two or one. 
But if you want, you can spend one of your skill points to add your luck to it. Oh, so that'd yeah, be that's right. I keep forgetting about that. So you go back up to a five if you want. I'd say do that. I feel like I'm going to have to do that because yeah. dice hate right. me right now. Wait, can I have Whichever one? one you want. <laughs> Yes! Oh. Yes. Nice. Good thing I spent that it? or it wouldn't yeah. have worked. Yeah. Yep. Nice. Okay, so. I'm gonna attack the one that we already attacked, obviously. Mm -hmm. You smoothly force the enemy back, deal two damage, and move the monster one space. But I believe the two damage kills it. Yep. Oh, nice. Good. Okay. Sweet. So. What do I do with it? Oh, I just put it back in the witch bag? Yeah. Witch bag is the witch bag, but... Mm. <laughs> Who's on first? Uh. <sighs> Where's Des, though? <laughs> or Ronan. Right? Damn puns, though. Okay, so is that all of you guys' turn? Uh, Yep, mm -hmm. I think so. Okay. Now, do they get to attack me on your turn? Yes. Yeah. If okay, I choose great. to. Okay, wonderful. I know. It's the greatest, right? Mm, it's the greatest. What are these other stacks near, like, the human... Okay, there's a monster one, and what's this beast? So, yeah, if oh, depending okay. on the monster, it could be either a beast, an eldritch, or a human. And Is so anybody trading items or anything? Okay, so do you think we need to keep the key with who? With, with lantern? Me? I mean... You're not claustrophobic anymore. Well, the problem is if we the, go... If I try to run into the closet, I'm not going to have enough actions to open yeah. the lock because of the darkness. Okay, I'll just... I'll, I'll give you the, the lantern. Well, how about, how about if I give you the key? Because you're still low on sanity. Yeah, right. just give him yeah, the key, and then, and then and then I can stay something. and keep fighting. Yeah, okay. you can range through the door. Sounds okay. good. We got this. I'm I'm like this smart book chick with an axe. And you got, <laughs> yeah. you got a pistol. Yeah. I'm a badass. I'm like Buffy over here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and you lose your stun token during this stage. Oh, sick life. You're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so how does the lantern work? It makes uh, light. It so it, as an action, which you can make me do an action, right? Yes. Uh, discard this card and deal three damage to a monster within one range. Okay. Is this one range now? It's not through. Uh, right, it's through a it door. Is. No, it's through but a door. I think it count, but I think it counts as one range. It counted for your guns. It so counts for the gun, but the gun answer. specifically says that you can attack through a door. Okay, that's fine. That works too. So I'll just move the monster. Okay. Into the room with you guys. And we, so we have to do a horror check. We do. So it's minus, or it's plus one. So it's willpower plus one. Willpower plus one. All right. So yeah. seven. What did I have to get? And I got an eight, of course. So I take sanity damage. Yeah. Yes. And I I pass my check. Okay. Now is and this just because you guys haven't seen the witches before, or every <laughs> right. time you go into the room with the witches, you're gonna get scared by them again? Every yeah, time. Exactly. Oh. Every time. So if the Isn't witches. That weird. Move, you get so you get really go, bad amnesia. Yeah. Can I go back in there? Yes. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Isn't that strange? Yeah, you guys are on your own with that. Like, <laughs> oh, my mother, okay. Oh, they scare me again. Uh, ah, forgot there was a witch here. <laughs> um, oh, dear. Hey, I tried to scare them off, so, you know. <laughs> not, I'm not Get very bright. Get out of here, witches. Yeah. Bye, bye. Maybe if I shoot in the air, you'll leave us witches, alone. Witches. How do I get it to attack you? Can I just not? Uh... Creature of Night doesn't say attack. It just says... Actually, at the end of your phase, it's a, it's a step we've been skipping. Oh, There's okay. A, after your actions are all done, then the Keeper may, so it's it's optional. I, okay. 
perform one attack with each monster that is in an investigator space. Well, first I'm going to make you use the lantern. Oh. So it does three damage? Mm-hmm. All right, we lost it. Wait, you lose the lantern? Mm-hmm. Yeah, because she, she has an action that makes you use an equipment uh-huh. uh, uncontrollably, so he just, like, <laughs> spasmed and threw the lantern at the witch. Oh, you can throw the lantern. Yeah, yeah. I guess, yeah. That sucks. Which, yeah. Does it do damage? It, does. it did. It did. Mm-hmm. It dealt three damage. Oh, to it. okay. Well, sick. Okay. So, conceivably, it's gonna be a lot. Yeah, it'll definitely be a lot that easier. Means, to that means we only have to do two more damage to it. Yeah. They all have different stats, but they're all oh, around really? the same. Yeah, but they're all around the same. The last one was five. So. Yeah. So it should be somewhere around, be around like, six or four, maybe. Yeah. If it's if, if it's different, six, five, yeah. or four. Generally, it's like around there. Okay. All right. So. Um. I'm sorry. That's okay. Do all those things. And then I will go ahead and draw a card. And I'll have to choose between the trauma ones. So I will do that in a second. Actually, I know I need to do it right now because you get. Wait, that's the only one. Okay, yeah, that one can go. Okay, so now it's time for attacking? Yes. Okay, so I don't really know its attack, so I guess I'll just go after whom I'm assuming is going to be weaker, which is Carl. Yeah. Because yeah. Joe Diamond is a beast. <laughs> he might be. <laughs> and Carl is such you- a... A pretty How little dainty lady. Not that, because she is a scientist, so she generally probably is not going to be as um, well, physically... she's going insane. So, I mean, it's <laughs> fair. It's fair to assume that she's probably going to be a little bit more frail right now. Yeah. So do I use the human <laughs> deck? Uh, you, yeah, because, yeah. And then you'll just read the bottom of it. Okay. And it should say um, versus human or, yeah, just monster attack, yeah. Your enemy begins screaming in a strange tongue. Test lore, see? Ah. See what? So it's it'll be good for you because you probably have better lore, right? Uh, six, but I'm in darkness, so four. I'm sorry. How come you don't have good lore in darkness? I don't, <laughs> I don't know. It's, a lot of this stuff weird. makes no sense. That is weird. This darkness is oppressing me. Well, it's kind of like an intelligence <laughs> check, right? And I failed it. So you gotta, so you gotta kind of see what you're looking at. How much damage do uh, I take? Two damage and one horror. Oh, wait. Oh, two physical damage. Your skin yes. begins to tighten as the spell oh, okay. takes effect. Sorry. Oh, good. What does that mean? Two damage and one horror, that's it. Oh, my skin begins to tighten, which means that... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> it's like Maybe getting it's Botox. Explosion. It's like, yeah, I'm getting Botox over here. Free Botox, <laughs> <Yeah>. guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really the sorry. witch is making your skin tight. <laughs> awful can you kill yeah, that damn thing yeah oh yeah no to. the witch is dying okay i'm i'm done okay put... so we okay oh this one has five yeah but unfortunately it's the next to the last one so i'm a little worried we still got to find two more clues yeah but you is it our turn the last We're one close. the witch yeah, is like our turn. here so going in here okay. wait all right hold on no i'm not why not i can't Darkness. Oh. We won't make it. Wait, well, you should at least... Why no, can't I, you move one there? closer, can't, I can't you? I can't, I can't go in there, but I can't do anything, so I might as well just fight. Just move one closer. Oh. Well, why don't you let me fight? I might be able to finish her off, and then we won't have to worry about her. Well, I can move over here, and then I can shoot that, shoot the witch. And then, and then you can go. always use your second at movement after. Oh, yeah, like after shooting? Yeah. 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 All right, I'm going to try shooting the witch. Wait, do I have to take a check to move out of her space? Uh, yes, you have to do... Um, and so you that. should shoot first, first and then... Yeah. Shoot first and then you can questions still do your later? Yeah. yeah. All right, what do I have to roll? It's... She's got to draw a ranged weapon Oh, card. right, she's got to do a ranged thing. I'm on it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> that was so <laughs> <Nice>. awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. 
I'm on it. How do I do that? <laughs> Ranged weapon. You hear the gun go off, but even in your shock, you aren't even aware that you fired it. Test oh, good. marksmanship. Marksmanship mm -hmm. is five, and the darkness is three. I'm spending two skill points to make this. I can do that, right? Spend two. Uh, I think you can only spend one per roll. Fine. It's like All right, so making it a five again. Somebody was playing... Um, and I fail it. Ah, uh, shoot. I know. So what happens on the fail? Um, You fired into the ground. No effect. No, yeah, well, that's good. Okay, yeah, not too bad. Okay. Um, I mean, I can't move anywhere. I have to stay here. Yeah. So uh, that's the end of my turn. So it's game phase's turn to try to do? Yeah. Why yeah. are you in... Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay. So I'm in a fire, and I actually get plus two marksmanship when it's in my space. Are we sure I could make you get rid of the lantern? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's so, it. So. It's a it's a good effect for the keeper to use. Yeah, the darkness just. Sucks. So I'm also firing my automatics. Okay. <laughs> darkness sucks. She said that she tested the worst. 15 times. I like, know. Bad, though. It's, it's all right. Uh, that it's every check. Okay, you you want you wait for the foe to get closer. Test intellect plus one. Oh, that's not what I wanted to test. <sighs> so it's five. Okay. Or no, my intellect plus one is six, but then I subtract two for the darkness, so it's four. Should I spend a skill point? Yeah. All right. I mean, I'm going to die this turn if we don't kill the witch, so. All right. Actually, I'm going to die this turn even if we do kill the witch. Why, I'll just die harder. Die this turn? Because, so if she plunges something else into darkness, then I probably fail the check and I'm down to one sanity. And at that point, but you don't necessarily die. Anything could kill me. You don't necessarily die. You don't die. die. All you gotta do is move Wait, your if, you're, if you have zero sanity, yeah. Yeah, you, you don't die. What, really? What happens? Yeah, it's just still... really scary cards I can play on you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. So I gotta get a four or less. Come on, baby. Nope. Five. Mm. Can't you use your luck? I did already. Mm -hmm. uh, use all, right. all of it? Yeah. Well, no, I mean, I use. I, you can only use one skill point per roll. Oh, so you I just used it for that roll? Yeah. How the fuck did you fail? Or how the heck did you fail? <laughs> <laughs> did I know. You have, wait, you had four plus three? What did you roll? An eight? No, I had to roll a four or lower. And yeah, I because five. of the darkness. Because of the darkness. It, because it was intellect. It wasn't. Yeah. It wasn't my good skill. My yeah, the card didn't have him use like marksmanship or whatever. But the luck, you don't add the luck to your intellect. If you yeah, I did. Point. I only added two though. So I started at five. I went down, or I started at six. Oh, your I luck's only two. two. Yeah. Oh <laughs> no. That's so, awesome. Deb, okay. if you want to come in here and help us kill this thing, <laughs> we could use some help. Well, okay. Doesn't my once per game ability count as? It's an action. That counts as an action, doesn't it? Yeah. So you yeah. can't really need to that. use that. Yeah. Otherwise, we're gonna lose Carl to some horrible insanity. Demon yeah. So if you want to, you can try to use it, but first you have to evade mm. the monster. I'd say just kill the monster. Like. Yeah. Just yeah. If I, I don't mean, die at zero, the, I thought I'd actually die at zero. Those, so I have to have the card anyway, and there are um, there are not a lot of those scary ones. Okay. Yeah. So come on down and join the jamboree. Okay. Um. <laughs> you were plunged into darkness. I was born in it. Yeah. Did by it. Oh no, the darkness. Okay, let's let's go in here. What do I have to roll to? So, so your first your horror check, which is willpower plus one minus two. So willpower minus one. Yeah, five. So five. Again. Come on, die. Wait, you know what? Screw these small dice. I'm gonna go big or go home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just putting it down. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? What did I have to roll? 
Uh, five, or... five, wasn't it? Yeah. Nice. Okay. Well, All that right. works, I guess. So <laughs> now are you... Weakest roll I've ever rolled. So now are you attacking with your That's axe? That's pretty bad. Yeah. All right. Well, that's all I have to attack with. So yeah. Melee weapon. You receive a burst of courage and charge the monster. Test strength. That's a sharp melee weapon? It says melee. So, so you use melee for either sharp or blunt. Okay, but that's there are no. certain cards that say sharp melee weapon. Okay. But there's, they're kind of rare. I see. So I do, wait, what am I doing? Strength. Yeah. Strength. Yeah. Minus with two. Any, minus two. Okay. What's my strength? Four. <laughs> So two, so you might two. want to spin your luck. Do you want to use luck. my luck? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Four. So, so roll the big so dice I gotta again. Get five. Yeah. Again. Nailed Are you it. kidding me? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay. Did you spend so, your skill point? Yeah. Oh, okay. There you go. Your weapon sinks deep into its skull. Deal weapon damage plus one. Ooh, so that's five. Oh yeah. Oh wow. That thing is dead. Wrecked oh. it. Wrecked it. You did it, Deb. Once Woo! again, saving the day. Yeah, <laughs> Buffy. That's my job. Buffy. Yep. Buffet. Uh. Where's the witches? Who moved the witches bag? Dang it, ogre. What? Is it giant? It's the giant <laughs> bag. Box is so big. <laughs> it's so that you know which one the witches go in. I didn't need that. I have to look at all of those. Thank you very nah. much. He loves giant sacks, okay? <laughs> oh, All right. So you guys did it. That's the end of your turn, right? Yeah. Uh, we need to trade items. Okay. Oh, trade yeah. Items. Yeah. Should I get uh, the key? Yeah, I'm going to give you the key. Yeah, because if I get the next clue, I get skill skill tokens. Oh, That's sweet. Like once per game. Do it. All right. Anything Watch, else? It's going to be all this, and we're going to get, like, you find nothing of interest. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'll literally cry tears of sadness. It would be most unfortunate. I am going to I'll cry tears of insanity. <laughs> can can her item heal even like the big insanity cards? Any tra any mental trauma, right? That's so nice for you, Ogre. Because like, you know, you know, like what happens if he hits zero? Then he just gets. Even if I were to f have a card and give it to him, she could just get rid of it the next. Mm -hmm. As long as you guys stay together, yeah. Like that's see, it's not so bad. It's good she chose to kill so, it instead. Does the same thing happen with physical? Do you not die when you hit zero physical? Exactly. No, no, that one you do die. Oh, you do die. Oh, okay. yeah. So it's just okay. mental damage that you stay on the board. I see. All right. So. Got it. Uh, I'm not. What are you laughing at? His miniature die. We're going. We're going micro. <laughs> Go micro or stay home. <laughs> Go micro and stay home. <laughs> and stay home. <laughs> Michael, look at how small it is. I think I'm just. Did you even roll a five? Going oh, to um, sp get cards. Okay. So tiny. Where'd the big one go? <gasps> That, is that the big one? You made it small now? The big one became the small one. Oh, okay. But it's the only turn I'm doing this one, so I, I don't have to spend a turn on it. Okay. No plunging into darkness? Shh, don't remind her about stuff. No, I'm not going to plunge into darkness. I don't know, maybe. All these other rooms in this whole wing of the house we haven't even been to. I know. What's this? A ladder? What's this? An altar? Ooh, that's scary. Yeah, there's two altars. I'm kind of worried yeah. about those. Oh. I'm not sure what those are going to do. It's you guys' Well, oh. we were, it's we were near turn. one oh, of them. Yeah. So, Deb, do you want to go first and use your once per game? While you still have sand? Heal me! Uh, yes. That's a good idea. So I just make everybody full again. So, yeah, for every sanity you spend, somebody gets four. But I can spend it on myself, too, so just everyone goes yeah. back to full. Wait, how? Because I've Choose got an seven. investigator in your room to... And we're all in you the same room. You can hypnotize yourself? I imagine so. It doesn't See, say it, you can't. It does Wait. say in the rule book that if there is an ability that says you could choose an investigator, you can choose yourself. Oh, okay. So, but it is just a once per game. Seven times four... Would just would be way more than enough to heal all of us back to full, yeah. Yours, so. yours is five. 
Vine is gonna be. I only have to nine. go up. So it's two. fourteen. Yeah. So everyone yeah. go back to full. Sweet. Full. Same. Oh wait, that's just making it bigger. I think that was worth. That was a good time to use it. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. Why do they say horror instead of sanity? I don't. So I think horror. Oh. It, take any number of horror. So sanity is your stat, and horror is the damage that your stat takes. But then it says heal for horror. Yeah. So heal for the damage back. But you can't yeah. go over your sanity. So if it said for sanity, yeah. it doesn't like add one sanity. Yeah. Add yeah. One. It is weird wording. Weird. Okay, I still so, have no idea wait. what's going on in this game. So, <laughs> what do you want to do? What do you want to do for your two actions or two movement? Um, well, I want to stay with you guys. Aw. Mm, yeah. I don't want to like go off by myself, so I'm just so, gonna stay here. I think. Okay. Oh, here I'm gonna go sit down on the couch, and then I'm coming <laughs> right back. Okay. There we go. Take a little breather. Where is yeah. the door? Where is the door? Where is the door? What? So I'm uh -huh. getting ready to go open the door, and uh -oh. she's saying, where is the door? Test your intellect. Where there used to be a door, the wall seamlessly continues. Where did it go? Test intellect. Mm -hmm. And it's minus two, too, isn't it? Yep, because it's dark in here still. Sure. So it's three. Do I want to spend a skill point? I mean, we have to wait another turn otherwise. Yeah. All right. So I'm at zero. So I'll put that over there. Um, so now I'm back up to five. Mm -hmm. I'm Iron Man. Yeah. Duh. Oh my All God. All right. Come on, five. Come on, five. Yes. yes. So I passed. Is that what's, hold on, is that what's playing like right now? It's like you're going in. You're Iron Man at the door. So well, yay, we're investigating things. Putting tools into things. Okay. What's that do? You get oh. a silver key. Nice. Yeah. And let me see what clue this is supposed to be. All right. Oh, it is a clue. None of the clues oh, are right. Oh, is that the duplicate one? Oh. So I just got four. They're all wrong. They were all wrong. That like a bunch of the clue cards were missing. It was strange. Oh, that's weird. You were in the coat room. So you found two B. Okay, so here's our second clue. You find a note. I'm sure of it now. I know where the whispering is coming from. I saw a drawing of the original old fort, and I think we can get in there from above. You must believe me, Amelia. They are the reason things have been so strange here, and they have plans for us. Horrible plans. I've heard them talking about it. I saw a drawing of the original fort, and I think we can get in there from above. You must well, believe me. He wants to go by attic? a helicopter. Oh, wait, I, I where's the ladder? How about the ladder? Or do you think it's the furnace room? Something? We can get into it from above. Wait, tower room? Yeah. Can we get up into the tower and then, like, go over? Like, yeah. Walk over? That could be a possibility, too. I mean, there's a lock over there in the tower room. Is that. I saw a drawing the of the original old fort, and I think we can get in there from above. Yeah, you're right. Maybe it is the tower, because that seems why it would say above. It means, like, mm -hmm. an upstairs room. Or like the attic. Oh, look, there's like a ladder stairs. down into this area. Yeah, Yeah, that's what I was saying. The ladder. Yeah. And the tower. But. From above. So now we got to run over there. Unless Let's it's it. like the attic stairs go into. So it's either. I think it's either going to be the attic or the furnace room. But since it said above. Why would it be the furnace room? Mm -hmm. Well, furnace because room I was thinking. Like, lower, though, yeah? like the old fort was buried below ground, but that doesn't make as much sense. Oh, and look, this one was built on top of it? Yeah, yeah. But that Indian makes more sense style. about the tower room. Yeah. Yeah. Let's try Plus, it. there's a ton of stuff in there. Yeah. Okay, so I actually am done. I can't move or anything. So I don't know what you guys want to do. Do you want to the stick best together? of you? Can you hear that ogre? Yeah, I can. Foo Fighters. It's Foo Fighters <laughs> right outside. It's Florence and the Machine on Sunday. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. awesome. I'm gonna die. <laughs> no, I'm All gonna right, die. So probably. So it's so. Wait, why are you gonna die? 
His health's know. at six. You, you can't heal six. that. Yeah. <laughs> well, don't. I would say don't leave the room. Just stay. Just here. Stay here. <laughs> don't right. ever leave. All right. Well, I mean, we we gotta swap like science notes. We're science bros. Mm. Science lady bros. All right. So I guess it's Gilly's turn then. For science. Okay. You gonna trade anything? Nah. Eh. Nope. Someday I would like to use my items. <laughs> Maybe I can Wait. do that on the journey. I never, I never went. Oh, right, okay. that's why we were saying. We were, I was, one, I was asking you. Oh. Don't go. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? I'm gonna do my once per game. Oh. oh. Once okay. Once per game. Do it. I'll I'm gonna roll and test six. I already got my threat for this one. Wait, round. hang on. Not this dice. Oh, but do, so it's gonna be minus two though, right? Oh, because I'm in darkness. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's the worst. Oh, well, I mean, so there's nowhere I'm going to be able plus, to go. So it wait, doesn't have darkness. Four. Wasn't there a thing we could do to get rid of the darkness? The lantern. Have a lantern. lantern. Oh, that was the only thing. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, ogre, you've got. Oh, but I can add skill to this, right? Well, Give me another light switch puzzle. <laughs> <I'll> <laughs> okay. Just... So. Fix uh, all the lights. Yeah. Ogre has two, but it's plus it two 17? for each revealed clue card. So that's. Four six minus two for the darkness. So that's four. And then you want to spin your luck. Yeah, and this this should be at one now. Okay, so then that's back up to six. Okay. Where's my tiny dice? There it is. Okay, I need a <laughs> tiny one. All right. Lucky tiny dice, go! I got a nine. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid tiny dice. I'm deleting you two. Dang it! Oh well. You gotta, you gotta believe in the big die. So, so it's Gilly's back. turn. Unless you want to move, Ogre. Nah. Okay. Oh, so we were gonna get to read the objective card? Yeah, mm -hmm. so we would know how to win. We could win early. Oh. Possibly. Hmm. Um. So we have to wait three more Gilly turns to figure out what the objective card says. Yeah, we have to find that. Yeah, that. Last yeah, we got to go find our find the turn. Yep. So I'm gonna plunge some things into darkness. Of course. Where where has my darkness been at? I think this is the the furthest. So I'll just continue moving along. Is there only one lantern? <laughs> I don't know. There might be something else that gives us light, but. Mm. We'll start with the attic stairs. Okay. So that makes us all test willpower, right? Yeah. So I got to big five. dice. Willpower four. Oh, come on. I take another sanity damage. And then I'll draw cards and then I'll be my turn. OK. Oh, not the whole deck, please. I don't want that. Did someone take sanity damage this turn? Yeah, me. Uh, I did. Oh, I hadn't drawn cards yet anyway, so. But yay. So is it our, our turn still? Um, or I just need to put one of these, and then you're ready to go. Oh, one of your cards went in the bag. Oh, I think it's supposed to be I, here, though. I got it back out. Oh, yeah, OK. Thank you. No problem. All right, so I guess I could take my turn first. So you guys know how far I can move. If you want to kind of stick together or not, I don't care. Oh, yeah, One, go ahead. One, two, three is how far I can move. I'm just going to I'm gonna move into the same room, but yeah. up at the front. Yeah, good plan. This is going to take forever. I know. we got to march across the whole thing here. Done? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, do you I, get, I still have an action, right? Maybe I can yeah. do one of my do items. Spell. Yeah. Oh yeah. See if you can see if you can learn that spell. That's my intellect thing. Plus one. So it'd be minus one effectively. So it'd be wait. Five. If I. Uh, where was I before? If I go. If I go in here, I don't have to do that stupid darkness thing, right? Oh yeah, that's true. Okay. You going into a bathroom? <laughs> the bathroom with the light. Yeah. A bathroom? No? 
No, I'm not going in the bathroom. Oh wait, I must have used that. You're good. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now you just have a test of seven. Isn't like plus one. So, so okay. Yeah. And then if you want to add your luck, you could make it a ten. Or your skill. Um, let's just chance time. Wait, is this the? Oh, that's not the big one. I need the big one. That's a six, right? Yeah. Yay! I did it. So, so what did I do? Discard this card, and you get a soul packed spell card, which is that? this one. So basically, what happens is you just get the top spell card. Of, and then when it's your turn you can do this action and they can basically heal horror she's but then you have to test lore flip it over and see what happens so it's a surprise as to what happens as an after effect oh are they generally good uh if you pass if you pass okay. the lore check yeah hmm. okay that's cool they're usually not terrible well i don't think we've had anyone lose horror yet horror yet have we I, don't know. I will remind you that there is one card that if you fail, you got devoured. Remember? Really? <laughs> really? Yes. Oh, I think it might have been a really powerful one, though. It was. Like, a, I think it was a more powerful spell. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, that's my turn then. Okay. Okay. I um, just remember that I'm one space behind you guys for when you move. Okay. Got it. I had drawn one threat. I'm just going to keep the other two in there and plunge a room into darkness. We'll continue on with Attic Loft. So we have big die. Don't Do fail me now. Wait, I'm not in a dark room, so I don't have right. to check, right? Yeah. Noise. You right, you fail. don't have to check. Snake life. Uh... Guys, I got nine turns left before I go insane again. <laughs> well, there's probably not that many turns left in the game. There's probably only seven. <laughs> Done. That might be a problem. All right. All right. Oh, you're done, Gilly? Yeah. Already? Wow. Okay, so I can move one, two, and then I'll stop here, because I think that's the furthest that Deb can move. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll well, I'll just... go ahead and move here, because we'll all be in the same room at least. Yeah. Okay. All right, Deb, you want to catch up? Yep. Doop, doop, doop. Done. I feel like we're like retired people racing <laughs> down the I hallways. <laughs> it took us forever to get that stupid key. I know. Yeah, that's crazy. We had I honestly to feel like we should have just kept exploring the rest of the house because it didn't really do much. But we are we going to need that silver key? Yeah, yeah, we will. I bet we'll need it to open this attic up here. So we would have had to have gone back and gotten it. That's oh, okay. I see. Is it my turn? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. I get three. I'm going to plunge a room into darkness and draw cards. All right. So now I have to check. So which one? Uh, this is all one room, right? Yeah. This attic loft. Uh, you can do the study. Okay. Willpower. So it's the Shit. willpower minus two? Yeah. I miss our lantern. <laughs> Me too. Oh, God Me too. damn it. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. This is just minus one, right? Yeah. Uh, I don't think I've passed a single one of these. I know, I haven't either. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Maybe we should stop drawing a graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're tempting pain here. Okay, I got this. I can fix this. All right. Okay, and I am done. That's it, right? Yeah, so we got to do an event. Okay. I think we are B. We are. Happy little flowers. Bad to Happy worse. Beautiful. Is that what I'm it's called? Going, I'll read it. Yes. It says to reveal the objective. Nope. Oh, yep. The two students' arcane experience, experiments are having side effects. The keeper places a hound of Tendalos in the attic storage. This hound of Tendalos has plus four health per investigator. So 12 extra health. Jeez. Uh -huh. Okay. Say, so, and I reveal the objective? Yeah. 
in the attic. Wait, what? Wait, what has 12 more health? This so hound right this here. this hound that just spawned is in the attic storage, which is oh, he's freaky right looking here. Too. And so it's got 12 extra health on top of its health already. The keeper wins if the hound of Tendalos escapes from the gallery. The investigators win if the hound of Tendalos is killed. Oh. Escapes from the gallery. Oh, so it's going to try to so he's run gonna try through and the run house. out here. Right. Okay, so you remember the vent I told you guys about? Oh, he can probably oh, move through shit. that. He can skip from here to here in one action. Uh, so it's actually good that we didn't go all that way up there. Because we would have just... Yeah, yeah that, that would have been bad. I wish I would have known that. However, that's a huge amount of damage, though, and we're rolling against darkness. Yeah. And he can probably still move without killing us, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How fast can you move? Um, I think the... The, it's my card, and it's two spaces per round only. Yeah. Move every monster one space, then beast monsters can move another additional space. Okay. Let's see. Where is he? So can we put up this barrier two, like behind us so he can't get out? Three, four. We could do that. Um, what does do the barrier what, do? So the barrier blocks the door so that the, the hound can't get through. It has to attack a barrier to get through that doorway. So one person could go through that doesn't have a very big attack, block the doorway, and then the other two could try to stay here and shoot at it while it's trying to break through the barrier. Is, okay. the, is the hound so going to try and kill go... us? Probably, right? Well, uh, I think it's going to just try to escape because it has to actually attack the barrier as its attack in mm. order to get past the barrier to keep moving through the gallery to the ground. Okay, so gallery. I'll, I'll go through and move it. Because I have a melee weapon anyway. And you guys can stay where you are and shoot it when it comes through. Yeah. And you have... Well, Ogre has the worst health, but I don't think we have to worry about it straight up attacking us yet. Oh, yeah, no. I think it's just So there's, be there's literally nothing else we have to do but kill this thing, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. We so we can just chill here. This is yeah. weird how this ended up. Like, mm -hmm. you guys didn't have to go through any of the... Yeah. Well, I think we got so far behind because we were so slow. Yeah, but it's really stuff. detrimental to me that you got so far behind that you are right where it needs to go through. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's weird, but that's like benefit, I've been playing it well and it punishes me. Well, the weird thing, so this is, we can talk about this when we talk about the game, but I've this is actually the exact scenario I played the other time. And I'll tell you what happened when we played that. It was like the exact <laughs> opposite. Really? Yeah, we were like you up were in, in the, the attic. Wrong corner? Yeah, we were up in the attic and it escaped and it just went through the vent and it was suddenly five spaces ahead of us. Oh jeez. Yeah, we were but that's the... it's weird to me, right? That I've been like slowing you guys down and stuff. Yeah. yeah. And so that you wouldn't have like as many items and stuff and yet you still got all got weapons and you're moderately healthy and well, but, you're but, right where you need to be. Right, it's but weird. remember it should like Scott... get to escape out from where it's at. Yeah. But it, it's got a huge amount of health. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. But it just yeah. seems weird to me. Yeah. Because usually we, I want to delay you, right? Like, I want yeah. to put you behind. And the darkness, you've been doing a good job with the darkness because now we're at a disadvantage with all mm -hmm. of our skill checks. Yeah. Um, Strange. So that helps. What okay. we might want to do, though, when it escapes past the barrier is put you guys in the bathroom that's so going to go into darkness. Well, Sorry. Yeah, but... <laughs> <laughs> There's going to be no, right. no safe place. I guess maybe I shouldn't have said that. No, no, no. <laughs> I, I was already aware of that. Okay. okay. Well, is it... Whose turn is it? It's all of our turn. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm going to move back and put the barrier in front of the door. Okay. Does she have to be on that side of the barrier? in order? To... Oh, uh, I guess it's a bookcase. So, yeah, probably. Yeah, because it's in that room. I see. This, yeah, we can't move it yeah, out of So I can't. Okay. Yeah. Nailed it. So I guess I'll move here and because uh, I get extra if I'm in the oh, same. Well, actually, I can here. get that if I'm even if I'm one space away. I get the benefit with my guns. How wait? How many turns is it until the thing gets to us? Because we could potentially go get this thing. It can only move two spaces. So one, two, three. Four. So, so it's going to take two turns to get there. Is there any way we can get that item that's in that this one? One, two. 
Okay. Well, we won't make it back in time. Won't make it back in time. Yeah. One, two, three. And it might be nothing Move, of interest. Check mm -hmm. it. Move back. One, two, three. Yeah, it's going to be one turn too many. I mean, we could send one person over there. But. Oh, no, it would take too long because it's darkness. Never mind. Not worth. All right. So. Mm -hmm. I'm staying where I am. Are you doing anything, Ogre? No, I'm going to stay where I am. My I action was to move the barrier, right? Oh, hold yeah. on. Did that you... Okay. Did you already... It's it's still the same turn, right? I should give her the ruby of relay. Oh, but I can't do that because it's not the beginning of her turn. We don't have to, we don't have to barricade it yet. The, the ruby allows you to, you, if you spend an action to cast a spell, you can take an additional action afterward. So I don't think we have to worry too much about our sanity now at this point. No? Well, I mean, we'll have a horror check when it first enters the room, but if we don't stop it from getting through the barrier, we might not. Right, but well, here's, okay. the, well, how here's, about... here's the problem, though. She can keep plunging stuff into darkness and just not move the hound any closer to us. And we'll just keep taking sanity damage and... That then doesn't do anything. We'll die. You won't die. Well, we'll be at a severe disadvantage, right? I mean, if I can find so, those cards, but she just heals those cards. So here's something. Here's something about the game. If we get to the last card, which we're on right now, mm -hmm. there's a possibility that if she doesn't get him out of the house, she could lose the game as well. If I no, see. If neither side has met their objective. It's possible for both of us to lose the game. <laughs> I'm just going to do that. Everybody loses. <laughs> I'm going to make you guys. All of us lose. Nobody's happy. And here how, <laughs> how does that happen? No, so, I'm not going to do that, Deb. I, don't, I, I want it to be like an epic story battle. How does, that, how does that happen, though? So, what is okay, so when we get to this last event now. card, sometimes it will say if neither keeper or heroes have, have completed their objective, the hero, everybody loses. <laughs> oh. <laughs> It'll say that on this last card. Sometimes. I don't know. It might not, but. If I'm okay, going to um, lose, I'm I would gonna... make it to make such an end. I'm not going <laughs> to move, I'm not going to move the barrier this turn because we still have another turn to move this. So I'm going to stay, I want to stay in here and use one of my cards. Cast your spell. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to cast okay. my spell. Yeah. We've got a little bit of time. Okay. Um, so choose one investigator in your room to heal one horror. Who? Please to heal Carl, horror. Yes. Do you need that? Okay. Yeah, I've taken horror damage every turn. Then test lore. Flip this card over. What's my lore? My lore is five. Mm -hmm. And minus instead two. of minus two. Okay, but maybe I can use my... Plus a luck. Luck, yeah. So... Seven again. Uh, let's see. Three... And then your luck is four, five, six, mm -hmm. right? Oh, it's my lore. Oh, what was I looking at? Yeah. My lore is five minus two, three. Four. Okay, yeah, six. Okay. Wait, let me put this down one. Okay, let me roll. I need this. How do I make this die even bigger than this? Pl the plus key. It. I, they're max size. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay. <laughs> So I have to get six or under. I like how the octopus is like shredding a guitar right now. <laughs> no. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? Ugh. Okay. Aw. Oh, well. That sucks. Well, so oh, you happened? still have to resolve it, right? Yeah. Yeah, that sucks. Fail. Time seems to stand still. It may have only been a minute, but you fear that much work. Oh, my God. Stop moving your hands in front of it. <laughs> Much horror can be found within a single moment. The keeper gains three threat. Oh, okay. thanks. Oh, that's oh, a card. No. Now you draw a new soul pact card. This card, yes. this card, and draw a new soul pact. Oh, yeah. hello. Keep casting. Yeah, you 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 get to keep the spell forever. You just have to get whatever detriment oh. every time you cast it, and it's this new Neat. surprise detriment every time. <laughs> surprise detriment. <laughs> yeah. Interesting. A different surprise detriment in every box. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Detrimentos. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So are we going to do anything? Uh, I am going to move. Oh, wait, I haven't moved yet, space. so I'm just going to move. Okay. Here. Let's all oh. just move into depth space. Why are we moving here? Because I want to give you this uh, this thing so you can do it twice. Oh, okay. Oh. 
Okay. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna stay here. Okay. Wait, That's I thought you were gonna move into the section with the little dude. Well, I uh, guess you have time. With the space. But mm -hmm. the other thing is that I actually get the benefit with my guns, even if I'm one space away. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. Cool. All right. All so right. I think we're done. All right. You trading? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What are you giving me? What is this? Giant thing? ruby. Oh, it helps your spell casting. Once per turn, after you spend an action to cast a spell, you may take one additional action. You may not cast the same spell. Oh, okay. Oh, so you get to do two actions. Okay. Mm -hmm. So she'll get to do some sort of action along with it. It may not be that helpful, but she's the only version with spells, so she might as yeah, well have it. Yeah, that's true. Where is the ruby? Oh. So, Gilly, did you see this? What? What'd you paint? Yes. Okay. But I, I don't didn't... know what, what it is you're pointing at. The oh, spell? Yeah, you could use it on the spell. Why would I want to help you heal? Well, because if she fails the lore test afterward... Oh, right. And she did use a... She could... Yeah, she could. it could be detrimental to her. That's true. Which is my word of the night. <laughs> <laughs> detrimental? detrimental. Mm -hmm. uh... What is this red blob over here? Which red blob? This Is that the dragon? The... That's a dragon? Oh. Well, I'm going to move know. first, of course. No, we're going to erase that. So that's it was too one. small for the clouds and moon I was trying to draw. There's not oh, that's cool. I that was a cloud and moon? Yeah, dude. Oh, Hang on. okay. We're going to draw better. All right. No, I think okay, the, the moon was on the right side, right? Yeah. Okay, I saw it. I saw and it. Cthulhu is rocking out on a guitar. Here, how about, how about <laughs> yeah. I draw the... Wait, let me draw... You draw the moon. Draw a blood moon, and then I'll draw the dark purple clouds. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, right. it, it should be. It should be a round moon, right? Because it's blood moon. Yes. All right. Hang on. I just okay. saw one of these, so. <laughs> <laughs> I expect a full scale rendition. Okay, we're gonna put the bathroom into darkness. Okay. Goodbye, bathroom of safety. <laughs> and, comfort. safety. and puzzles. Well, I was puzzles. In there earlier, so. The thinking room. You guys should, after there all, correct. Do your tests. Yes. Nope, I'm immune from tests. Just, ah, all right, got just it. Just mark from tests. Is it, what is it? My thing. My, uh, Willpower uh, minus two. Again? And I fail. I don't even know why I roll anymore. <laughs> Dang. Well, hurt me. All right. Ooh. Ooh. These clouds, they're so ominous. Spooky, scary clouds. <laughs> Looks so like a Deb, <laughs> the real actual game of this has some amazing miniatures. Oh, really? That he wants yes. you to paint. What? Did I? <laughs> I didn't even, wasn't even thinking that. I don't even know <laughs> what you're talking about. <laughs> huh? Painting? What? You paint? <laughs> That's crazy. These these clouds came out really terrible. I'm so sorry. Worst clouds NA. I don't even know what's uh, going on. I'm going to be drawing a bunch of cards, probably. Sorry. That's sorry. okay. Oh, what happens if I'm out of Mythos cards? Do I just pick these up and shuffle them? Yep. Yep. I just want to say, though, I think you've been doing excellent on the keepering. Thank you. I, f I felt tense the whole time and that's true yes in darkness obviously that's the wrong card thank you <laughs> those devil horns maybe <laughs> <laughs> nice he's hiding underneath the basement dang it um I guess I'll use this to cause you to do your spell, but on yourself, not on Ogre. Okay. 
Stab so the devil with a sword. Okay. Alright, so I'm just gonna try to roll a three or lower. Okay. Wait, so I go up up one of these though mm -hmm. first? Okay, yeah, that's good. And then roll alright. Come on, three. Oh, oh, that's not nice. a three or lower. Wait. Okay. Oh, I thought you just you didn't just roll this one. No. My bad. No. <laughs> Lame. Yeah. Ogre, what's your take one damage? Oh, Wait, okay. you're taking physical damage? Yeah. Yeah, you powerfully feel your heart pounding in your chest and sweat pouring down your Hold face. Hold on, please. That's not great. Another one. Oh, sorry, I was getting you. I'm sorry. That's okay. Wait, are you testing lore? She did already. Yeah. Did Did you include the plus two from the ceremonial skull? Oh no. yeah. No. She still would have failed that. No. Oh. But yeah, we do. I but I would have passed the other one. I don't remember. I can't remember. <sighs> Sorry. We have video evidence. You probably you probably did. Yeah, I would have because I had I had to roll a five and I got a seven. Well, did you take a horror damage as a result? You could just no, take it back. Something, no, something else happened. Uh, Gilly got three. Yeah, she got three. Uh, I can put them back. Things. She got three of those. Then we got to figure out what the positive was. The, posi though. the positive was each other person in the room gains uh, sanity. Oh, okay. So I go back up to full, I guess. Yeah, and I got to nine. But All you right. did take a damage this time, correct? In case you go up to yeah. six. Yeah. I and added you. What is a curse? I don't know. And what's your health at now? Seven. Okay. I've never heard of a curse. You made a look at the card? Yes, please. Sorry. No, I. It, all it says is you are cursed. I need to know what a curse is. Um. The only thing I can think of is that it might be something in an expansion because it's oh. not in the base game. Uh, let's see if there's a... Well, I could get rid of it and get have a different card. But I've never heard of Curse even the expansions. I thought I had yeah. expansions. Wait, is Curse the, op Curse is the opposite of Blessed in these games though, right? Yeah. yeah, but the weird thing is, is I don't think I've seen... Does it say at the bottom what Cursed is? Curse tokens? Yeah. I don't... No, it doesn't. Um, but it does have a little moon at the bottom of it. I don't know. If oh, I'm yeah. I think that might be an expansion oh. I don't have. Oh, okay. It's, then... it, I just found curse tokens online. Hmm. It's the keeper can use these tokens to force the investigator to reroll a skill check. Oh, okay. Oh, that's, that's all it that's is? That's easy to yeah, remember. That's all okay. it is. Um, okay, then I don't want that. Okay. Yeah, you acquire to to curse tokens from a variety of game effects. So it sounds like am, you, yeah, you assign them to people if you want. I am going to give you this one. Minus two to all attribute tests in combat. Oof. You now have a broken arm. <laughs> okay. Well, just during combat. So when I'm fighting yeah. the warg thing. Yeah. Okay. Right. That's fine. So, Gilly, are you moving? Did you move the hound already? I did move it already. Oh, okay. And um, I'm good. Okay, so I'll put the... Uh, event so I'm going to draw cards one more time, and then I'm good. You go ahead. I put the event token. Okay. All right, so... Did the hound are we move? ready for this? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, it okay. did. All right, I'm going to move back in here so I can fire my gun. Okay. Fire my lasers. Fire my lasers. All right, so if I move the... If I do something else... Wait, doesn't... Wasn't there something that I have that gives me two actions? Yeah. So I have to cast a spell. You can cast a spell and then... And then move the thingy? Move, yeah, mm -hmm. and then do the thing. Okay. Do I want to... Want to cast a spell? 
Do I want to heal? Wait, why can I hear myself? Heal horror. It's just a horror, and you're already at max. Yeah, it has to be in your room. Oh. You're the only one in the room. Oh, but we can't take this out of order. Dang. You could move in there. Well, I'm just Cast maybe I'll just do the ceremonial skull oh, then, so yeah. I can get some skill points back. Yeah, that might be good. Ogre, have you taken your turn yet? Yes. Uh, test your luck. So the sad thing about oh, this is my luck is poop though. Yeah, and you can't use a skill point to add luck to your luck. Right. <laughs> and also, so my luck is what one now? Yeah. Failing this one gives Gilly four threat. I I just don't think it's worth using the ceremonial skull. <sighs> But what you could do is you could move into move into this room, heal one of us, and then move back. And then barricade the and door. And then barricade the door. Okay. I'll do that then. I wanted to throw a painting at your head, Ogre. Oh, okay. You can throw a painting at my head. Okay. <laughs> so could you test willpower plus one and dexterity plus one, but then I don't know what the modifier. So minus one. Willpower. Yeah, yeah willpower minus one. And I fail that one. So I fail the willpower check. And dexterity minus one is what you said? Yes, uh -huh. yes. All right. So four or lower. Oh, I actually passed something, you guys. Yay! Nice. <laughs> I you passed, passed the dexterity one. No, I just, just passed the dexterity. Just the I, we're not aiming very high here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I passed half of it. <laughs> so you no. took a horror hit? Yeah. So you're at eight then? Okay. But I dodged the painting. Excellent. Go you. Okay, so now I'm going to heal you for one horror. Thank you. And then test my lore, which I have to roll a three or lower. Here we go. Oh, no, but it's a five or lower because I have that artifact. Yeah. Here right. we go. Okay. One more time. Everybody's feeling fine. Here we go now. Yes, yes, yes. Here we go. <laughs> and sick has got the flow. That is a throwback right there. Yes. Come on. No. Ten. Ah! <laughs> winner. Big winner. Literally the worst at rolling dice. What happens Can I just to you? roll dice in real life? Like. <laughs> and then report the results. It, take yes. a picture and send I'll it to take us. A, I will take a screenshot. <laughs> oh my god, it's so bad. Hello, tablet. <laughs> What's the tablet doing over here? Yeah. I, I was going to look something up. Tablet uh. is drunk. You need to go home. <laughs> yeah. All right, you go ahead and look All something right. up. All right, so I'm not doing anything on my turn, I think. Yeah, so I think it's the end of our turn. Mm -mm. Okay. Back to you, Gilly. Oh, this tablet's talking to you. Oh, I'm sorry, is it? Yeah. Is I'm it? Sorry. I can't hear it saying anything. That's where it shouldn't be. But... Maybe you should read what it typed. Can you not see that? What did it say? No, you can't. It's like, hello, Gabriel, I am the tablet. Ooh, scary. <laughs> <laughs> I am your new master. <laughs> Bow to your tablets. The Foo Fighters are done, Idea Matrix. I'm sorry. This concert ends at 10. Um, okay, well, I'm going to pay to move, my dude. Can I change my crayon color? How does the vent work? Does it use a movement, or is it just like... Color. How does, it work? How does what work? The vent work. So basically you move from one vent space to the other and it costs one movement point. Okay. Wait, hold on. We didn't finish. Uh... Yeah, we didn't finish. We didn't the finish, finish Deb's turn. Because I have to go back in here and move this stupid yeah. thing. Boop. Okay, well. So that's done. Unless you wanted to prevent her from doing something. Can I make... Is there any way to make her move that with uncontrollable urges? Like, can I make oh, her like destroy remove it? the barrier? Uh, let's see. Can what I make her stuff? attack the barrier? You, only monsters can attack a barrier. Oh, okay. Um, 
Mm, it just says it has to be a spell, equipment, artifact, or tome card. Okay. No, your hound has to attack that, Gilly. <laughs> <laughs> Cannot force that open. She could throw more paintings on my head. <laughs> <laughs> I may. <laughs> I'm trying to see what those cards say, monster versus barrier. Oh, like how they attack the barrier? Oh, oh, monster versus barrier, yeah. Okay, well, that makes sense. I wonder he's, what he's just gonna wreck the barrier. Uh, it possibly, yeah, because its health is like huge. So if that if that card gets drawn, I shuffled it again. Mm -hmm. Wait, does Deb have the broken arm? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Making that bigger. It's just during combat. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just move this up here. Never forget your broken arm. <laughs> What does this eight thing mean? Which eight thing? Uh, oh, an eight on the I have side. To have at least that. I think yeah, she can health? only play it on you if you have that amount of health eight. or lower. Oh, right. See. Right. That's pretty high. Yeah. Yeah. Jeepers. I mean, I only. Considering I started eight. with nine. But normally we don't have to deal with the darkness as much on other scenarios, so minus two yeah. is too bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Under normal circumstances. Okay, I'm done. All right. She's plotting our doom. So there's another event token. Mm -hmm. Bye, Rex. Okay. Bye, Rex. So there's really not much we can do, right? Unless. I don't think so. I think it's just hanging out again. Yeah. Just hanging out. Hanging out. All right. So back to you, Gilly. We're just letting her okay. take lots of turns. Yeah. Jeepers, mister, you sure are strong. Does attacking count as an action, or is it like... So how, you, how it works is you do all of your actions, which includes movement, and then um, the monsters attack. I mean, for you, do you, oh. you guys mm. attack? Yeah, it's an action. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So if you were to have to do something else as an action, yeah, we wouldn't get to attack. Okay. It's good to know. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me make sure I do this correctly. And before she spawns monsters on this side of the barrier. Yeah. I can't get out. You guys have Rip. Rip. Okay. <laughs> My broken arm. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Well, she could just move un like undo the barrier, right? It's it's pretty uh, it's pretty likely, at least from the card I saw, that you have a good chance of tearing it down, Gilly, because you have so much health. I know, but I, I, I am executing a plan, and I have uh, to make sure I do it in the correct order. Oh no, I know. I was just tell I was just telling you what that card said that I saw, just so, to give you that information. Um, then... Who's you on here, investigator? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna start calling you Illidan. I'm sorry. <laughs> the betrayer. I just have to help people when, because I, I always I feel sorry for the person. I want to win, 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 no matter what. <laughs> I think you'll probably win. <laughs> Two, three. Okay. <sighs> so. Uh oh. 
I am going to... Who has worse checks between you and Ogre, like, when it comes to fighting? Because I know you both have a gun. Oh, but you have to play this on our turn. But you could play that, like, right at the beginning of our turn. Oh, that's right. You're right. Sorry. You're right, you're right. That's okay. I'm fine with it. Then now I have to make sure I'm thinking correctly. Okay. So I'll use one to move him in. Let's call him Tendi. Then he can move again. So he's here. Wait, or is he just here? He would just be there, and then on his turn when he attacks, after your actions are done, then he'll attack oh, the barrier. Oh, he's so cute, mm -hmm. though. Is he? <laughs> yeah, look at how cute he is. He is he's like not a fucking... cute. He's like a dragon thing. You don't think that's cute? It's adorable. <laughs> look at his little face. Oh my god, look at his it's little got like eyeball. like one giant foot. <sighs> he does. He has a stump foot. <laughs> oh my god, Tindy's the best. Hello, Tindy! Tindy. <laughs> it's catching on. Tindy's too small to be threatening. Make him bigger. I can't. I already right. tried. Mm. Small Sorry, one. I just, I really have to make sure I have my threat right. That's this okay. is like my most important turn, I swear, guys. It will be Stomp. faster after this. That's all right. There, that's hey, my Hey, guys. <laughs> hey, guys. What are you doing? This is Tindy. This is Tindy. <laughs> I just, Tindy out. I drew him better. Oh, God. Nice. <laughs> Tindy the squiggle. That's, that's the best I could do. I couldn't remember. So what you two have to make right. horror checks, correct? Yeah, you're right. Can you go ahead and uh, do that? Because I actually need the math. And it'll be minus four. Two for darkness and two for his horror check. It's got like a little so wingling. I have to roll a three. We're doing horror checks? Yeah, minus four. Oh my god, really? So it's Come willpower. on, stop! It's willpower minus four. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Oh, good. That's a Damn two. It. So you lose one, right? Okay. Yeah. Hold on, Wait. I'm going to put this down. Just you guys? Yeah, because okay. he's in our room. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's good. And I'm I failed miserably again. It's all right. I'm at an eight. Still got eight. Plus, like, that is that technically considered a combat? Uh, No, it's a horror check. Oh, okay. it's out, yeah, it's so separate. game face, I'm making you panic. I can't. All right, what do I have? What happens? I'm moving. What am I going you. to do? There's nothing I can do. I need to get out of here right now. It takes a deep <laughs> breath and then screams. <laughs> I need to get out. So you can move me three spaces. Dang it. What really? Yeah. One, two, three. Jeez, that's a long ways away. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Then... Holy creep. Why wouldn't you run toward the exit? Oh, because of barricade. Okay. Yeah. And I get to choose where I move them. I yeah. know, but still. Um. You're hungry. So hungry. Who, Tindy? No, I am. <laughs> Got like. Eat okay. something. Minus so, five to hunger right now. That's it. <laughs> that's it. I'm just going to go. <laughs> I think. Hey, Game Face, can you grab me something from the freezer? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> While you're in there. <laughs> okay. The, the so samples sorry, are took sounding so long, tasty. But I had to like no, no, no. count out my stuff. So Tendi is now going to attack the barrier. Okay. So you draw beast cards Eep. until you get one that says monster versus barrier on the bottom. Monster versus barrier. Deal one damage to the monster and the barrier is destroyed. Okay, so that's... <laughs> that didn't last very long. Yeah. Okay. So you take one damage and that's it. Okay, I don't know. Okay. And then you're done. How much extra health does it have, they say? Twelve. Twelve extra health? On top I'm of gonna what... I'm going to need... Is. A notepad. 
Good. Uh, it's good. If you click on Notepad and switch to Private, you can keep track of it on there. It's okay. I have one opened up because of the clues earlier. So 12 extra held on top of what he has. Mm -hmm. Okay. And he just took one? Yep. Okay. So now he has 11 plus X. Uh, I'm good. Which is probably really high. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. So our turn. Mm -hmm. Oh, we gotta add a new event token. Mm, okay. So I, so I could go first because I I can still shoot him if I get up there. Can I have you? a range of two. Yeah. Oh, so I sweet. Could yeah, do it. Wait. One, stop. At before the door. Just stop at the spot that you're at. Okay. Okay. Take one horror. Yeah. The keeper that may, may then move you up to one to two spaces. Wait. Wait, where's that card? I'm sorry. Right here. Oh. Basement or any room in darkness. Uh, <laughs> no. Okay. Yep. You can do it now. So you're in the freezer. Oh no, it's the place <laughs> I'm afraid of most of all. And you're in the freezer. Oh, you can only play one card on me. I'm sorry. I did not know that. Sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't. I haven't seen it yet. That sucks. Oh. But I can't get a shot off, so that's good. No, but I. That was the whole plan that I was taking forever to come up with. I'm sorry. Yeah, you can only play one Mythos card per investigator. Okay. But that's like the perfect one because I can do nothing on my turn. I can basically. Yeah, but go the I had something much better to plan planned. But I think it's over that for me. I, I'm not going to be able to keep up. Oh, with the hound moving? Yeah. Yeah. Well, Dev, it's down to us. I don't think we can kill this. Oh, I'm going in. All I'm right. moving on top of the hound. Gilly, does anything happen? Hold on, let's see. Actually, yes. Hooray. Wait. <laughs> Did I get rid of that card? Dang it. I think I got rid of it. Way oh, back good. In the day. Way back when I made you get cards. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um. So yes. I'm gonna make a ranged weapon attack. All right. Got to get at least a little damage on this sucker. I know. All right. I'm gonna try. Okay. So it's a ranged weapon attack on a beast. Yeah. It's beast, Gilly. Sorry. Okay. Okay, you repeatedly fire at the monster's head with professional skill, text, test marksmanship plus one. Yeah, so six minus two is four. Plus so, one. No, no, that was including my. Oh, okay, sorry. Yeah, it's four. Do you want to add your luck? I have no more luck. I just deleted the die. Oh, okay. It's gone. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You just go delete happy. Ah, oh, oh. fail. I okay. shoot into the air and try and scare it away again. Right? Uh, it ducks at the last moment and you <laughs> swing. Wait, that's melee. It bolts out of the way with impossible speed. No effect. Ah, uh, crap. Impossible I've... speed. Impossible. Uh, just have the worst right, luck. Okay. So do I move? I have to move in there. Yeah, yeah you got to move in. Yeah. Uh, we got to do it. Hold on. Let me see what other stuff i have because combat i'm like basically should not even attack yeah but that's person. the only way we can win i know but you don't understand how nothing it's gonna do <laughs> do not so, really. should i should roll. i try casting my spell i mean you might as well reasons uh, um right you've got tons of sanity though i don't you can't heal it she can only know, heal people but... in her room well, I could go in the room and then oh, heal right. him. Yeah. I think you should probably just try to attack. Yeah, because I, I... Well, she can use a spell and also attack. I can attack. do both. Oh, oh yeah, well, yeah. Right. yeah. Yeah. So, okay. So... Which one would you like to do first? Oh, What do I, I have to do have, for the check? You have to do the spell first. Well, I have to no, do No, she has to do a horror first. check, too. Oh, uh, it's uh, willpower minus four. Willpower minus four. So, so two. So six again. Yep. Roll no, okay. you have roll one or a two. Really you got nice. this, don't worry. Nailed it. Nailed it. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Okay, so nothing <laughs> happens? Right. 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 Not afraid of you? 
<laughs> was that the heel? Spoopy, spoopy Tindy? For the horror check. See, spoopy. Tindy's so cute. Oh, okay. I'm not even afraid of that thing. <laughs> you Rape are a woman brilliant. of science, and no beast from other realms <laughs> shall scare you. No one-legged creature scares me. Okay. Um, even Tindy. Even Tindy. <laughs> the magical beast. So now you Frog door spell. beast. <laughs> yes. Now I heal you. He does have one. an arm coming out of so, his back. So heal, right? It's a wingling. <laughs> so heal yourself, Oga. Oh yeah. Right. I get to go back up now. And then you do a lore check minus. So minus two? nothing because I have the plus two. Yeah. So right. it's just a five. Right. So lore check five. Here we go. Let's go die. No! <laughs> that literally cannot roll anything but dead. <laughs> right, so the fail effect is the entire room shakes ominously. You fear that strange forces conspire against you. The keeper gains three threat. All right, what ifs? I'm making you a special new, new rolling die, Deb. <laughs> oh, Thanks. that's nice of you. It's, it's gonna be, it's gonna be perfect. Can you make it a different color? <laughs> yeah, it's purple. Oh my god, that's so good! Yay, go. <laughs> purple! Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. All right, so now um, you gotta try to. Sh she's gonna try to do a melee attack with her axe, right? Yeah, I guess I have to. Yeah, sharp melee against a beast. Tindy doesn't happen to be carrying any puzzles. <laughs> <laughs> the puzzle we were, of killing him. Okay, what we, are we were doing? good at those. Sharp melee? Against a beast, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I know. I want more puzzles. <laughs> yeah. Okay, does he have a lock on him that will just dismantle him? With all your strength, you plunge the blade into the beast's side. Test strength. Oh, so strength so minus first, four. Which is zero. <laughs> so... So you I have can't. to use my last yeah, skill point. Add your luck. Yeah. yeah. Oh, whoops. That doesn't. You could just delete it if you want. Uh, I'm just gonna <laughs> leave it at twenty. I think we all know that I don't have any more of that. Um. Okay. So it's gonna be three now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You got this. You got your pink die or purple die. Right. Fuchsia. Okay. Here we go. Wait, did you change the aspect ratio? Oh, that's still fine. It's not of like die? scrunched, is it? No? Okay. Oh, it's, it's all fine. <laughs> okay, are you sure? Ooh, we okay, there we go. Three or lower, three or lower, three or lower. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's so close to a two. Uh, don't think that was the color for her. No, Nine. Effect. No, it's not dark enough. It's going to okay, be a darker hang on. purple. That's the like creature's a thick hide seems Come impenetrable. No effect. No effect. How about Ooh, that? Yes, that's that's a good color right All there. All right, so okay. I think it's back to Gilly's turn. You guys trading anything? No, nope, still not the right color. <laughs> <laughs> we can go darker. We can go darker. Oh, you want me to plunge a room into darkness? No. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what? That is not what I want to do. Wait, can you make this die black, actually? Oh, yeah. Okay, great. Okay, so one to move them. Yeah, there we go. Oh no, that's not <laughs> you good. moved it while I was editing it. <laughs> okay, there, there you go, there you go. I was born of the dark. What? <laughs> yeah, your sunshine. You shook the color <laughs> off of it. <laughs> the paint was still drying, Deb. Jeez. Uh, I love um, this changing dye. All right. Okay, what's going on? I'm draw a card. Or draw right. cards. I literally can't attack this stupid thing if I proc strength. A broken arm. Can no one heal me? Heal my broken arm. Okay, no. um, I'm gonna get another Sadly. card. That is the wrong side for those. Could you stop, Ogre, please? It already takes me long enough for my turns without you annoying me. Fine. Putting it down. Hey, what happened to your... I don't think this thing wants to stay dark. I don't know. I'm just It's just color change would die. I have no idea. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, oh, I put those in. Okay. I'm gonna plunge a room into darkness. No. So we have to test again. What rooms? This room. The study. Okay. And you should all have to test, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's minus two still, right? Yeah. Oh, I was so close to passing my first one of these. God, me too. <laughs> okay. So you guys both took hits? Yep. Yeah. He's at three, I'm at four. Yay! I nice. pass. Finally. Okay, chrome dye it is. Yeah. So I metallicized pretty. it. Yeah. That's really cool. Can you metallicize the ones that are different colors? Over each yeah. time yep. you enter a room containing another investigator or one or choose your room, test your willpower. If oh, you fail, no. you take one horror. That stinks. So you should be the first one to go into the next room. Mm -hmm. Well, no, if one enters in with you two. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then uncontrollable urges. I'm going to move game face killer back one. Wait, why wouldn't you move somebody else? Because you have a range of two, correct? Yes, but I, I can, this is the, the furthest I can move is here with three moves plus, or two moves plus my action. I can't do anything. That's, I that's a range I, of two. Right, but I can't shoot unless the door unless I'm right next to the doorway. You will be. No, I, I if I move one, two, I'll be here. Oh, I have to okay. Be right next to a doorway to shoot. So you should probably move someone else. I'm already I'm screwed as far as being able to do anything. One, two. But. I think Tindy's gonna get away, guys. Why can't you? Oh, okay, I don't understand. I'll I move... guess you could move me back still if you wanted to, but. Well, if I move her, she can't attack it because it's a melee, right? Right. That's so true. the only one who'd be able to attack is Kate? Yep. yep. Smart. Yep. Okay. So then I'm done with my turn. Whew! All right. <clears throat> so it's up to you, Kate. You might as well go first because none of us matter. Hooray. I'm going to run in here, charging at Tindy. I'm going to test my thing. Wait, why is this at 20? It should be at 4. And fail miserably. Oh. I mean, I don't you even take, know. I don't even know why you, I roll. I take you two. Take one. No, just one sanity. Okay. The, the minus two is for your, <laughs> minus yeah, your okay. willpower. And I'm just going to attack. So ranged against a beast. They said yeah. Dev can actually pass a strength test. A one is an automatic pass no matter what. Oh, yeah. That's so true. You, yeah, if you're rolling a d10 and you roll a one, no matter what the test is actually at. So you'll should still she have rolled for the attack? She did roll for the attack, didn't yeah, she? Yeah, she yeah because attack. she had a luck. Because I rolled luck, yeah. Okay, yeah. so yeah. We're, she's fine. Yeah, so the nice thing is you can always do skill checks. You just have to get a one. So you want a ranged? Yeah, mm -hmm. against beast. Okay. Thank you, Smash. Yeah. I have done that, so. You empty your entire clip into the horrible creature test luck. Oh, God. Yay. So... I have to roll a natural one. Uh, <laughs> Wait, forget this die. I'm using the chrome die. The, it feels like the darkness yeah. is so OP. Well, yeah, well, yeah. you cast it everywhere cast in the beginning of the map, yeah. which is where we so had to close. go. But if like, you think I shouldn't about be it. able to get rid of the... Oh, there's my one. Or it shouldn't cost <laughs> so much. Yeah, but on the other hand, though, that's your only advantage is the darkness. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, we, we would probably be doing like seven or eight points of damage per... Well, That's the fact true. that we were delayed so much in the beginning half of the map where mm -hmm. the yeah. darkness was spawning constantly is like a huge detriment to us now. Because, like, there's, there's still rooms up here in the tower that have no darkness. Yeah. Like, if we had gone there, maybe if we had gone there faster, maybe there wouldn't be so much darkness where we are. But there would, yeah, it's always there hard would be tell. by now. It's always but, hard to tell when to split up. Yeah, yeah. It is really, it's very scary in this game to split up. See, and the nice thing is if we had four players, which is why the ideal is five, then you could split up into two teams. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that makes she sense. got a little protection. Right. And it just would have had a few more hit points. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So did you hit? No, not even a little bit. 
Okay, um, your shots throw you off balance, but injure the enemy. Deal weapon damage minus one, you are stunned. So you still do damage. Yay. What's weapon, weapon damage? Four. Okay. Minus Wait, damage. hold on, plus two for being in the same space. So five, or so six, but five with the modifier. Okay, now I just forgot how much health it had. It had okay. minus. I remember, I remember. Okay, okay, so how much damage did you do? Five. Okay. That's good. You've are you the only one that's done damage so far? I mean the barrier did damage, so Deb did damage. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> did that count as my damage? Oh, okay. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, so you guys are done? Mm-hmm. Uh yeah. Did you no Deb didn't move up? Did she? Oh right, yeah. So Deb gets to move. Oh, that's right. Uh I'm gonna Cast something. You gotta do a sorry. You gotta do a horror check first. Okay. That's my uh, minus willpower minus four, so two. So two again. All right, whatever. Doesn't really matter. I'm just I'm so afraid. Ah. Okay. <laughs> um. So I will do the. I guess I'll do this silly spell thing again. Yeah, so who needs to be healed? Ogre, do you need healing stuff? Oh, I don't need to move this yet. You, you'd you have to be in my same spot, right? Uh, no, I, I just have to be in the same room as you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you can heal me, room. that'd be sweet. But okay, don't you need so to attack? Take a, take a heal. She can't attack. Oh, no, I can't, can't attack. attack. Okay, sweet. So you're going to uh, heal this this crazy thing? I'm just, yeah, I'm just going to heal you. And then... Wait, heal me what? To... Which, which kind? The Santa. horror thing, the sanity. Santa. Oh, you're using your soul pack. No, but I was. Uh, yeah. So, like, you also have this. Apparently, the overlay. Just oh, got do wrapped. you have trauma? Oh, did it? Oh, yeah, the overlay. Oh, somebody, somebody's video just dropped. Oh, we reached the hour, four hour limit for the call. Oh, <laughs> he does have a trauma. And ogre, did you roll when she entered your room? Yes, I did, and I lost another sanity. Okay. Well, let me fix this really quick. So you have an insanity trauma? Yeah. Can yes, I deal I do. this? Even well, though he has this. Can you reveal? Can I yeah, still do this? I think so. OK. The keeper deals you up to three damage. So you can we get the video damage. back, can we not? No, we, we can't remake? without. We have to remake the call, oh, Okay. Oh. which I can do really quick. OK. Yeah. All right. One second. Just hang up and recall it. That's yeah, all you yeah. should do. Hello? Hello. So he takes three damage, right? Yes. Okay. What's that? Why am I seeing? I don't know, but I'm getting an echo. Can you turn, turn your mic off, please? Can we still hear the echo? I'm right here. Can you not hear me? <laughs> no, <his> name is Carl. <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> what happened? Hold on. We're, We're in multiple calls. We're in multiple calls. That's why. <laughs> Just a second. Uh, I don't know how, but I am in multiple calls with you guys. That's happened to me before. It's so weird. So, Skype is how. Yeah, this is so so bizarre. Hold on, I'm just gonna close Skype entirely. I'll be right back. Okay. Sorry, guys. This has been quite a journey. All right, let's see if we can get these guys back on the call here. All right, we have a gilly. I'm scared. You're scared. We're scared. We're about to let the uh, hound of Tindalos hound of Tindalos out upon the world. It's fine. The army will probably be able to take care of it and stuff. Right? I don't know. 
three better magical than investigators weren't doing a better to. job than you guys are. Let's be honest. Hey, you guys I, are... I am missing my microscope. I B-rate. really needed that microscope. You are B-rated <laughs> investigators. Not even a little bit. What We're is fine. happening with this call? You know what? I'm going to make the call. Okay. That sounds good. You okay. might have to move the cams around and overlays. Yeah, that's fine. I can handle that. Hello. 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 Okay. Hello? Yes. <laughs> like lost in purgatory or something. <laughs> yeah, something, something about Carl's Skype. I, oh, yeah, okay. I have no idea what was going on. Hi, Gabe. Oh, Hi. Who's did you guys that? turn your video back on? <laughs> we did. I yep. did. Rip. <laughs> okay. It? Oh, there we go. All right. Just came back. It's like, what? Okay. Can we just finish this game? I know, right? <laughs> Four hours later. <laughs> oh, good. Everybody's in the wrong place. Wee. <laughs> Who do I All get right, to be All right. Well, while today? I get this, while I get this fixed, you guys, uh, you guys continue on. All right. Well, where were we? Where were we? Uh, um, so Deb, Deb I was am doing my spell thing. Yeah. So she, oh, right. she failed the lore check, right? Or did you do the lore check yet? I haven't done the lore check yet. Okay. Rating so Smash says, are you guys applying the attribute effects five. from darkness to horror yeah. checks? Because it only affects combat rolls. Son of a... That... What? Darkness only affects combat rolls? To be honest, though, we've not... Sanity has not been the problem for them <sighs> yeah. anyway. Like, they're completely fine. I yeah, mean... It, it is during combat, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Womp, womp. Oh, we've been applying it to everything. We've been applying it to spells and Just everything. Everything. Oh well, my god! Literally everything. 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 How did we not? Oh, like no. dodging the your like crazy paintings you're throwing at my face <laughs> and like. <laughs> so darkness, darkness Horror broke checks the game and... because we were playing darkness wrong. Darkness. Yeah. Well, now we know why it was so. Oh OP. my yeah, god! That is yeah. why so it was so OP. Powerful. All right. Jeez. Okay. All right, well, that'll do but it. But you guys were in the right spot for the combat. We played the combat right, and he's still getting through. So yeah, like, that's, that's true. Insanity's not been an issue. We're just playing so. on hard mode, but guys. But it's not the insanity, though. My spells have been missing. Yeah, but your is, spells have not been... Is huge, isn't it? Like, I don't know what the spells do. Well, but... you still you still heal the horror, but yeah, it's mm-hmm. just the whatever the side effect is to you. You've given me, like, a little bit extra threat. A little bit. Yeah. Three every time. It's like That's nine no, so no, far. No, 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 Only two. The other time, you, you didn't give it to me anyway. You didn't fail it. So, like, maybe I would have not been able to move Gabe back. If you want, Gabe could have an extra attack just to see if you would get it, if that would make it. I still would have moved him back. Mm-hmm. At least once. Uh, let's just I, uh, okay. Well, let me s- try to do this lore thing then. To be fair, you keep so rolling. Gotta, you let's... keep rolling O's anyway. So I've got to do seven. <laughs> I just There's, have to do seven. Is it yeah. you guys' turn again? Yeah. I can't we're, remember whose turn it is. We're still on Deb's turn. Yeah, I'm and still then, rolling. Okay. And then it's your turn again. Okay. For fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Chrome okay, dies, right. letting you down too. Yeah. Okay. I hate these dice. I need my dice. <laughs> can yeah. we can we teleport them into the I game? like I like physical Please. dice better than the ones in here too. Yeah, I don't. We just need that little dice but tower this is from the other game. still better than va- vassal dice though. That's true. Yeah, that's true. We do need the dice tower. That was the best one last game. Yeah. Uh, I can dice get... tower. So is it my turn? Yes. What's a dice tower? I'll, awesome. I'll pull one. I'll see if I can get one. Sweet. Does it like roll for you or something? You just Basically. Double, yeah. and double gilly. I don't know what that means. Because hmm? we were, we were both in different spots. I think video wise. One, two. Wait, how do you get out? Okay, so I have, have to, to. You just have to use a movement space from the entrance. I think. So I'm in the gallery, and I only took one movement. So am I out? Take one damage. No, you have to be. Four. This is the entrance space. I think. Okay. I don't get how I would, if I had been stopped any longer, we would get to this, by the way. Right. Well, we would have, right? Because we're going to put one more this time, and the next yep. round is when I would escape. Yeah, that, so you really yeah, have to, like, book close. it. Yeah, yeah. Everybody has to book it on this one, I think. You are inside a coffin, buried alive, and clawing at the lid. You snap out of this terrible illusion, but discover that your fingers are still bloodied. Ew. Uh, 
Get rid of this spell. It's horrible. Gross. Oh, I know. I had to take. Oh wait, there's only one more. Yeah, but then we just reshuffle. The whole four of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Sheepers. All four. The win on that one isn't so even we... good. Yeah. Do we want to feel... make it so that Game Face can attack to like mitigate the darkness or what? I I think let's just keep playing it as, yeah. out as we have. Okay. Like, so I'm gonna move him back. At then. this point, the darkness thing changes so much about the game that. Yeah, it's completely we'll different. Just, we'll just keep playing it the way we have. It's fine. I guess we were just playing it on hard mode. That's exactly. All. It was hard if mode. If you're like, here, when you still have the mode. range? Uh, I ha no, because no. I have to be, I have to be next to a doorway to be able to fire through it. I think, or okay. I at least have to be one, two. Oh yeah, because if you move three, then you're not gonna. Okay, that's right. right. My range is two. Whoops! So. I didn't mean to be that. Okay, uh, I'm done. Okay, so I can't do anything during my turn. So. It's just up to you guys. Did you? Wait. Hold Wait, on. Was... I didn't get to where, where, did, my where did this come from? Turn, though. She gave I that, that to you. I oh, still you had didn't take down more... my health. I yeah. still had an action to do. As I moved twice and cast a my... spell, so I still had an action. And this isn't. Oh, so. There's what happened to the other card? It's underneath, I think. No, she cured it. Right? Deb? Yeah. You no. Cured my... when... So you can only have one mental trauma at a time, so it replaces the other one. But this oh, one isn't one that you keep. This one just deals damage and it's done. Okay, then it's just discarded. Okay. Okay. So she cured the other one? Did I? I like Yeah. I think so. I guess she would have, because you were in the same room, mm -hmm. so that makes sense. Okay. And she couldn't remember because she couldn't attack. So the thing that she was going to do was cast a spell, and then she has a second action from okay. the ruby. That's fine. Yeah, but there's not really much else she can do, right? Yeah. Yeah. Man, the spam we just have been that. Yeah. Okay, so it's just well, up to I, you guys' action. I was actually going to move closer instead oh, okay. of mm -hmm. doing that, but it's, you do it. We'll go no, ahead. No, no. What was the you, what was the effect on you? You cured it last. Oh, you cured it last time. Yeah, you oh, it was during your last four? turn. Right, yeah. Because okay, last so time you could had one I still had one movement then. Well, uh, I moved I moved twice and I was going to run as my third action, but I had to cast my spell beforehand so I that think I could have another action. I think you were here so you only moved once. Yeah. So you I thought I was I was time. I thought I was here, so I moved one two yeah, and then I, I cast I back. cast my oh, you spell. Moved her back. Right. I cast my yeah. spell and then I still have one more action. Okay, well the curing so thing move. the curing thing so we need to know then, if I give him this card, does it... Does it replaces it, the other one. It replaces this all alone one? Yep. Because okay. you can only have one mental... Well, then take health back, because I don't want to do that. Okay. I like this card. Yay. So, so I need... So what was the... What is the ailment? Because I need to know if I'm curing that or not. Right? Every time you... He, he goes into a room with someone, one of you guys, or someone enters a room with him. He has to take mental trauma. Mm -hmm. But it's not going to make a difference. Oh, okay. All right. Because, so I would rather be closer yeah, so that I have closer. a chance of attacking that thing. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So you want to move one closer? <laughs> what? I did. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. All right. So it's just now it's back. I think Gilly already took her turn, so now it's back to you guys' last. Okay. So if you can't so do this anything, is our like action. final yeah. hurrah. This is it. Yeah. Can we even get close enough and attack it? Because it's yeah, dark. Yeah. Because both of you can move too. Uh, that's only for searching. Oh. Okay. I'm going in. All right. Are you All going right. in? Oh no, no, you go I'm first. Going in. I so you two. need to do a horror check for it and a horror check. For it. Wait, two horror checks? No. Just one oh, for just, it. Just the one. And it's just a minus two. Okay. Yeah. So four. On willpower. On yeah. willpower. <gasps> Guys, I passed a check. Oh, my God. Nice. Oh, yes! my God. oh, no, it is a one. Yay. <laughs> Guys, I finally passed a check right when it counts. Okay. So okay. you're attacking? I'm very excited. Yes. Okay. So, so it's is... a ranged? Yep. 
You shout to gain the beast's attention. Wait, and then shoot, yes. Test marksmanship. Okay, three. Do you, do you, oh, you don't have any skill points, okay. No, I got nothing. Oh, and I missed. That sucks. that's so close. If you had got, if you'd hit it, it would have stunned it. Right, but I would have uh, still had one movement. If a monster is stunned, you may not move or attack. So that was really close. Oh, good. Thanks for <laughs> almost making all of us lose instead of just you guys. That's really nice. The monster is enraged. If the monster's at the same space as you, take one damage. No. Get off. All right. So, Deb, it's up to you. Here, you can have hearing loss because of that. <laughs> oh, good. It replaces my other physical trauma, right? Did you Wait, fix what's my, your other? Did you fix my concussion? Minus two intellect. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, dexterity would be worse. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so you have to do a horror check. Also, Ogre, you need to do a check oh, to yeah. see if you take mental damage because she's in your room. Oh, who keeps changing my dice? Oh, I'm, I don't know. It's not me. <laughs> One. Okay. Again. Yes. Okay. Chrome this was supposed die. To be a two. Here we go. Uh, I just have to. You have to roll a four or less. Oh, okay. Come on. Nailed it. Oh. It's not a four. All right, whatever. It just takes sanity damage. Yeah. Okay. I give zero Fs about sanity. Zero okay. Fs. Now I need to attack this thing with my negative two arm. <laughs> 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 uh, okay. So I have my melee weapon. What happens? Nope. That's the whole deck. It's fine. We're fine. Sharp melee weapon. You aim your attack at the creature's face. Te test dexterity. Oh, good. Dexterity is actually one of my higher two. Nice. Five. So, so just the minus four. two? Minus four? four? Oh, because yeah, the darkness actually applies to this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I just have to roll a one. You got it. Where's the chrome this is the, one? This is the one rolling machine right there. You know, F this stupid die. Go away. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye to all the things. All the dice are going away. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's stuck Hello? in a crack. Hello? Pick, it, pick it up and roll it again. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I don't know about that. But, but okay. I, I kind of felt like you need to roll it. Really? I get, it's going to yeah. stun it. It's going to stun the monster, so I will also lose. But uh, I don't know. It's fine. It's kind of a roll. We can do it and see what happens. I can't keep the thing. Let's keep the one. Let's keep the one. Let's keep the one. Okay. It's fine. It's a miracle what does it one. Do? Uh, you deal weapon damage and you stun the monster. So weapon damage is four. Okay. All right. So do we just want to see what the last event card says? I mean... That's really the only thing that makes a difference at this point. Well, you guys it, could... I mean, yeah, I guess. Well, no, we read it after your turn. So really, do, right? there's nothing you can do in your turn that's going to make a difference, right? Well... I would have hopefully done at least some stuff to like push you back or something. I don't know. Well, basically, this card either says that we both lose the game or you get out. You'll be able to get out. I don't. I don't know. Okay. What do you want to so do? let's just read it then. Why don't you let Gilly play the thing though, right? Or yeah, is this is this part turn. literally like the end of the game, no matter it, what? It might be, but it, we don't know for sure. So she could just. I guess she could just go ahead and do her turn. I was just yeah. trying to speed things along. Nah, we're already four hours deep. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Um, Oop, one of them dropped into your white space. No, I've got them all. Oh, I, I saw it disappear. Oh, yeah, I can still see it. Uh... I guess I'll just move you back. Me? Yeah. What am I going to do? 
You would be within range. Oh no, no you wouldn't. No. Why didn't you move? Uh, That's a good question. Did I, didn't I take my turn though? No, you, you would be mm -hmm. here. Okay, so then you're gonna move me back? Well, I don't know. <laughs> you could, if you moved me back, I would have to take two horror checks. I'm gonna move you here. Insane. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> God. I'm in the closet, guys. <laughs> I'm so in the closet. <sighs> Maybe if I wear enough jackets, I won't be able to see the horror that's going to be unleashed <laughs> on the world. <laughs> that sounds about right. I need to put on all these coats. I'm so cold. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> go ahead and yeah, flip the. Uh, what? Which? Yeah, one? we all lose. Yay! We all lose together. Which one was it? B. Fog begins pouring out of the angles of every room. More of the strange creatures have arrived. All players lose the game. Eesh. What? Yeah, the last event card was revealed, which all players lose. Well, Jeez. why does... I don't understand how the, the Keeper doesn't win that. I, know, I, I don't understand either. More I don't, make any sense. The Keeper would have won if she'd been able to get, a, get out. Well, which right. I would have this turn, but he was stunned. Yeah. Because the miracle roll... <laughs> miracle. <laughs> it's not my fault that stupid thing was in the way of knocking the die off the board. All right. Craziness. Well, crazy. Yeah. Yeah. We will have a lot to talk about in the discussion, which I'm assuming we're still going to do, even though this lasted four and a half hours. Uh, let's. Yeah, we'll just do a quick one. All right. We'll do a quick discussion. We will be right back after a short break because I need to grab something to drink. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. See you guys in just a little bit. Yay. This did not.